you love cookies. In this video. OMG, guys, there's already cake over there. Ah, ah, wait, I think I may just, I just fell. I tried to get over to it, but wait, now I can't get back. Is there an invisible wall here? I'm gonna go around here and see if I can kind of like get through. No, oh my God. Uh oh. I'm just stuck out here. Forever. You shall not leave. You're mine. What? The giant chocolate bunny's name is John? Survive the stage for 45 seconds. La 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 la. This evil chocolate bunny named John, he just put all these laser traps out here. Holy guacamole! One million lasers. Wait a minute, did I just steal a chocolate bar? Oh, the almighty delicious chocolate bar. Now I'm ready to die. Um, not particularly. Hey guys, what's up? Today, Daisy and I are at our favorite chocolate factory in Roblox since it's almost Easter. Molly, why are you so tiny and short? I don't know, but I should probably go inside. You need all the chocolate so I can grow as big as, as you. Well, um, I'm not sure that's a good idea, Molly. What are you talking about? That's a great idea. I'm going to eat everything in this chocolate and candy factory. Every single thing. First, we have to figure out how to get inside, though. OMG, guys, there's already wow. cake over there. <gasps> ah, ah, wait, I think I may just... I just fell. I tried to get over to it, but wait, now I can't get back. Is there an invisible wall here? Guys, there's literally an invisible wall that if you try to eat that chocolate cake, you are doomed. You never get to get back out. I'm going to go around here and see if I can kind of like get through. No. Oh, my God. Uh oh. I'm just stuck out here. Forever. It's time to... This game is timed. I can't get back through. Hey, hello. Can you help me? I'm stuck. All right, I just have to reset, guys. See you later, Molly. If you snooze, you lose. Daisy, you better wait for me. You're my sister. You're supposed to wait. I'm waiting for you. Oh, look at that cake. Molly, don't do that again, cheapos. But look, there, there's... Wait, is that an ice cream sandwich? Oh, MG. Mmm. I'm gonna break through here, guys, and see if I can go and get some more candy. Whoa, chocolate chip muffins. Mmm, those are some of my favorites. Yum. My sister is basically going to eat everything in this abbey. Uh, yeah, duh. This chocolate factory is like stuff that I would dream about in real life. If I could live anywhere, it would be here in this chocolate factory. Mmm. Donut. Oreos. Guys, what's your favorite treat? Let me know in the comment section below. Do you know what I had for lunch today? An apple. Blah. You guys know that I need to eat some treats now because I had an apple for lunch. Hey, what? I ate something healthy. Come on, Molly. Let's go. Something tells me there's a creepy bunny that's going to try to get us. A creepy chocolate bunny. What made you think that was going to happen? Uh, maybe it's that giant chocolate bunny that's up on the top of our screen. Ah! Oh, my God. Is that supposed to be the bad guy in this video? OMG! Is that the bad guy in this game? I hope he doesn't chase me. I might have to bite off one of his rabbit ears. Whoa, Molly Hush. <laughs> That's what I do when I get a chocolate Easter bunny for um Easter. I just bite off his ears. Then he can't hear me coming when I chew the rest of him up. Wow, Molly. You sound evil. What? He's chocolate. I have to eat him. Just the way it goes. First, we have to push all these buttons. And then probably the valve will open. Whoa. Guys, I have not died once. Now, I did get stuck in a part of the game that I had to reset. But I didn't actually die. Well, now you're going to die, Molly, because you said I've never died. I'm not going to die. I'm not going to die. Not even once. Wait, is this the right way or was I supposed to go that way? Yes, Molly, this is the right way. Says the person who's a noob and has died like three times. What? Okay, yeah, I have died a few times. Daisy is not on her game today. Boing. 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 Whee! Are you guys for, excited for Easter? Are you hoping that you get lots of chocolate? Ah! What? Oh, 
I was doing so good. I hadn't died. And then all of a sudden, Saw chopped my head off. That's such an evil way to die. <laughs> Alright, look up, guys, because there is Saws. They're definitely trying to saw me in half. Phew. That was a close one. Holy guacamole, climb fast! That's the rule of this game. Where am I? <gasps> I made a giant um, candy making part of the factory. Yeah, Marty, I think this is like a vat that they melt all the sugar and all the ingredients, like a giant pot. Oh, you might be right. What? You shall not leave. You're mine. What? The giant chocolate bunny's name is John? It's so random. Why is he chasing me? Oh, God. Survive the stage for 45 seconds. La, 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 la. Guys, I think I can pick up more health here. And it's probably a good thing because John the Giant Chocolate Bunny is chasing me! No! <laughs> it looks like he's gonna karate chop you. That's kind of funny. I have to go pick up some health because he's definitely taking mine down. Whoa! What's that? Oh, I got super running speed! Oh, I love that. Take that! Ooh, that's a bomb. <laughs> Does that blow me up or him? I'm not really sure. I will get you next time. Okay, John the Chocolate Evil Bunny. I just knew he was going to be the bad guy in this game. Boing, boing, boing. Well, this game is pretty fun, guys. I've played Anabi in a long time, so. I've been doing a lot of role plays lately, and I just thought maybe you guys would like to see an Abby. Which do you guys like more, Abbies or role plays? Let me know in the comment section below. We read all your comments, by the way. Um, okay, I gotta jump here, and then here, and then, oh my god, I almost jumped off the platform. And I'm feeling like it might be timed. Ugh. Uh, Daisy, are you supposed to wait till these stop? I think you are. Whoa. Oh my god, they're like giant blasts of cold air. If they hit you, they'll freeze you. Whee! I wonder if there's gonna be a speed run in this abbey, because I haven't done a speed run in forever. I kind of miss it. Oh! Killed by the lasers? Seriously? Oh, look, me and Bacon Hair. Back at the beginning together. <laughs> bacon Hair! You're a Bacon Hair! I don't know, I'm just making that song up right now. Um, why can I not jump over that? Okay, there we go. I thought maybe I was just, um, Ignoramus or something. Anyway, guys, what is your favorite candy to get for Easter? I can't wait to know what you, your favorite candy is. I would say mine, like if I was going to pick something, I would say either Reese Cups or Mounds or pretty much all chocolate. <laughs> I'm not even going to lie. But Reese Cups are pretty much my favorite. Molly, you didn't even ask me what my favorite was. Oh, sorry, I didn't know I was supposed to. Well, if you were gonna ask, I wasn't gonna ask. Molly, I wanna tell everybody what my favorite is. I like orange chocolate. So basically, they have chocolate, but then they put um orange slices and stuff in it, and it tastes so good. If you've never had chocolate with oranges, you should definitely try it. Daisy, that sounds weird. It's not weird, it's delicious, I'm telling you. I still say the best combination is chocolate and peanut butter every single day of the week. <laughs> I would eat that every single day if I could, but I don't always have it in my house, so sometimes it's just a treat that I get once in a while. Oh my god, these lasers are trying to kill me again. This evil chocolate bunny named John, he just put all these laser traps out here. Holy guacamole! Yay! Um, now, Molly, this part could be challenging because you already died in a vat of chocolate. What? Oh, man. Okay, because I have to go over here. Now where, Daisy? Uh, I think we have to float on those. Yep, you're totally right. Whoa, whoa. Whee! Oh, my God, guys. Look at those. Whoa, I almost died. Look at these, um. Oh, uh -oh. come on. I was trying to jump out of the gummy bears and I died. Oh, we're supposed to 
supposed to climb up here. We're not even supposed to climb on my gummy bears. Thanks for letting me know, Daisy. Well, I was waiting for you. I just didn't want to make you like feel like a total noob by telling you everything. No, you could have told me that. I didn't want to keep dying. This game is nothing but lasers. It's one million lasers. Wait a minute. Did I just steal a chocolate bar? Oh, the almighty delicious chocolate bar. Now we must escape, guys. And try not to eat the chocolate bar. All of it, anyway, before we leave. Wait, what? Don't chuck... Don't ch touch the hot chocolate. Wow, I couldn't even say that. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> oh, Marty. What are we gonna do with you? Just love me, Daisy, as I am. Ooh, look at those zebra donuts. Those look so good. This is making me want to eat a snack so badly right now. Uh-oh. Ready to die. Um, not particularly, are you? Mr. John, the chocolate bunny? With the karate chop arms? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. He's throwing out some lasers. That's his favorite. Oh, guys. Ah! Oh, I ran out of space. I have to run the other direction now. Ah! Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. No! Don't kill me! It says finish him. I'm trying. Oh, look at it. It puts out health and stuff, though. I like that. I need it. I need it. I really, really need it. I just picked up some health. Guys, I'm going to pick up super speed and a bomb. Very soon. Okay, there we go. Where is he? Okay, there we go, guys. Oh, what is he? Like the spinning rabbit of death? What? Oh, my God. Craziness. Where'd he go? Ah! He's right behind me. He's got a, he's got a belly button. <laughs> that looks so weird. Where is he now? Oh, my God. Wait, can he get me up here? Oh, uh, yeah, I think so. I thought maybe if I hid behind the giant donut, he couldn't get me. No, guys, not the truth. Don't try to hide behind the donuts. John the evil chocolate bunny is going to get you. Please have mercy on me, evil John chocolate bunny guy. Oh, no, he's up in the air again. That evil face, too, right, guys? Look at that evil face he has. Man, if I woke up on Easter morning and that Easter bunny was in my basket, I'd be like, uh-uh. He's evil. I don't want him. Take him back. <laughs> um, oh, I can get the running man over here. Let's go a little faster. Oh, he's doing the spinning rabbit of death. Get out of here, spinning rabbit of death. I'm not afraid of you anymore. Because I almost finished you. Kind of. <laughs> I still have like a quarter of the way to go. So maybe I shouldn't get too confident. He's like almost killing me with his crazy rabbit arms. Oh, there he is. Am I out of bullets or something? I don't feel like I'm shooting at him. Let's go pick up some more bombs. Oh, Daisy probably already won, didn't you? Daisy, you're like so quiet in this game. Sorry, I was thinking about all the homework I have to do. What? Really? Yeah, I'm not doing it right now because I'm playing Roblox. Whoa, Daisy, you rebel. I know, right? <laughs> I just needed a break from all my schoolwork. Like, it's getting closer to the end of the school year, and I'm like, oh my gosh, there's so much work. I mean, don't get me wrong, I really like the, my school and stuff, but holy macaroni and cheese. It's just like, is it summer yet already? No, not even close yet. Yeah, Marty, it's pretty close. We just have April, May, and then part of June, and then it's school already. I mean, out of school already, not actually school. Oh my god, he's gonna jump on my head in the last um minute of me killing him. I just know it. Oh wait, no, 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 no. Ha ha ha! I finished him! I finished him! Molly, we did it! Seriously? Did we win? You betcha we did, Molly. Oh yeah! It took us um like 13 seconds, I guess. Skip to the end. What happens if you're already at the end and you click skip? You still have to spend 229 Robux. <laughs> well, evil rabbit! Dun, 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 dun. We made it back out. And I did put some Oreos in my pocket. Marley, you took those from the chocolate factory? Um, I think that I paid for it dearly because, hey, he tried to eat me! 
Yeah, that is true, Molly. Hey, guys, thanks so much for watching. We hope you have a happy Easter, and we'll see you next time. Bye, guys. <laughs>
Um, but they did get the building look right. Yeah, um, we probably have to build the money. Which you won't be able to do, Molly, because you don't ever get to get a job because you never do your homework. What? Rude! Um, oh, look, this is like the little cafe. I think this is supposed to be Starbucks. Yep, it totally is. What? Wait a minute! This is Starbucks? But, but, there's no snacks! OMG. Okay, let's see what's in our inventory. Wait a minute. What's that? <gasps> Guys, is that what I think it is? I think it's a cookie! Wait a minute, where's that cookie I just threw out? I'm about to eat it. Wait a minute. Uh, oh, yeah, I mean, maybe it's good. At first I thought maybe it was a fake cookie. If it was a fake cookie, I'd be like, nope. Minecraft, two thumbs down. <laughs> I have to have my cookies. Doesn't matter what game I'm in. Um, can you stop eating them all? Sure, Molly. Mmm, ah, this cookie looks so delicious. Oh, I can't wait to eat it. Yum, yum, yum. Delicious chocolate chip cookie. Making my world so sweet and delicious. Ay, 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 Molly. You and your cookie obsession. Hey, what other kind of sweet treats do they have in here? Well, let's take a look. What? A giant cake? Oh, yeah, I'm throwing that out. Daisy, don't touch it. What? I can have some cake too, Molly. You're being so greedy. Oh, well, where am I going? <laughs> Obviously, I'm still learning how to play Minecraft. Oh, my God. I was, like, walking the wrong way. Oh, wow. Wow. What are you just blew it up. What are you doing? You blew up the cake. As I said, I might be a little bit of a noob in Minecraft. Molly, <laughs> cake right now. Okay, bossy jeepers. Um, all right, let me throw out another cake here. I'm gonna try to throw it right on the counter <laughs> instead of on the floor. I don't want to eat a uh, floor cake. No, thank you. Um, this time, guys, I'm gonna try not to beat up the cake. I'm just gonna eat it. Whoa, that is a delicious cake, guys. There's so much chocolate on the inside. Mmm, that was good. Okay, Molly, let's go check out some more cool things in this game. All right, yeah, guys, let's check out the rest of Brookhaven in Minecraft. Because that was pretty cool that we could eat cakes and cookies. But it's time to do some exploring. Guys, over there, you can see um, that is supposed to be the diner. And wow, I'm, like, super impressed by this. Holy guacamole. It doesn't look like they put much inside, though. I think they want you to build your own world, Miley. Oh, really? That's super cool and also a lot of work. Wait, what's that? Is that the house? Guys, that's the house we saw in um in Brookhaven. So here is the house in Minecraft. And here is the original house in Brookhaven. Guys, comment down below if you think the house in Minecraft looks like this one. So, guys, let's go inside. Obviously, um, Brookhaven is pretty sweet. Like, look at this. Look at that comfy couch. And the kitchen is amazing. But this one is nothing like the inside of the Brookhaven house at all. You guys, this one is so different on the inside in Minecraft. You guys can see the difference between the two. It is nothing like it at all. Well, it's still cool, though. I mean, it's still like a Brookhaven house. Wow, fancy tub. The um, bathroom in Brookhaven, well, it's pretty nice. But, I mean, they're a little bit similar because they have, both have tubs. And, you know, I would live in either one, really. I mean, they have cookies and cake. <laughs> and that's all I really need. Yeah, Marley, who needs to take a bath? Yeah. Wait a minute. Does this one actually have a potty? Yeah. What happens when I eat bean burritos? Wait, let's, let's, let's look. Molly, the bathroom is right here. The toilet, I mean. Okay, get, get out of there, Daisy. What? Did you have to use it or something? No, I just don't want you to break it apart. <laughs> you did eat a lot of cake. Molly, I'm not going to make the toilet explode. That's your job. <laughs> All right, guys. Let's go explore the upstairs. What's leaking? Um, that's not a good sign. Something is leaking in the Minecraft house. And, guys, the kitchen is, like, up on the second floor, which is kind of cool. So, do you think that this kitchen in Brookhaven looks like the kitchen in the Minecraft version of Brookhaven? Guys, if you do, slam that like button. I mean, I think it looks kind of close. It looks pretty close. Molly, maybe we should go up to the third floor and see what that is that's leaking down to the ceiling. Uh, my sister has a good point. This house might actually be, um, condemned. 
if there's a leak in the roof, so let's go see. And here's one of the bedrooms, guys. Wait a minute. What is that? Does it have a balcony, guys? We talked about this at the beginning of the video. I said, Minecraft's gonna win if it has a balcony. Yeah, it has a hot tub too, Molly. Whoa, I think that's what's leaking. Um, maybe. Who cares? Look at this view of Minecraft Brookhaven. This is amazing. Look, they even have the arch, guys. That is so cool. Would you guys live in this house in Minecraft? Yes or no? Um, let us know in the comment section below. I would live in it because, I mean, a hot tub, um, cookies and cake sounds like my kind of place. It is pretty nice, Molly. I mean, we'd have to build some more furniture and stuff. Yeah, when it gets dark, we don't want to run into any mobs. Molly, look! It's our school! I'm so excited! I could never be in Minecraft if it didn't have the school. Um, I could live without school. <laughs> Why do they have to have a school? Oh, whoopsie, I sort of fell off that giant brick wall. Whoopsie! <laughs> uh, Molly? It looks like the school is boarded up. What? Um, that doesn't look good. But also very good, because if the school is boarded up, it means it's closed. And if it's closed, no more homework, no more rules, no more the teachers. That's true. Really, Molly? Dizzy, are you breaking and entering into the school? Pretty sure that's kind of illegal. I made a way for us to get in. Now I can go to science class. Wait a minute. It's super dark in here. This is obviously where the zombie apocalypse starts. Um... Molly, throw out some torches already. Okay, my sister's being super bossy, just like she is in Brookhaven. Okay, I'll put it here. Um, all right, guys, let me throw out some torches so we can see where we're going. All right, I'm throwing out some torches. La, 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 la. I still can't see anything. Molly, I'm working on it cheapers. Ah, that's better. Wait a minute. <laughs> the entire school has been taken over by wildlife. Look at it. It's like just grass in here, guys. Let's explore this haunted Minecraft Brookhaven school. Creepy. Ooh. I missed the science lab. Um, okay. There's like a random hole in here. It might be a grave. No, Maddie, it's not a grave. My sister likes to make everything creepy. Pretty much. Um, guys, this is exactly how I pictured the school to be. Empty! Closed down! No homework! Yay! Alright, since we're talking about creepy stuff, I think we should definitely go and see if the um, graveyard from Brookhaven is in this Minecraft Brookhaven. Let's go. Guys, look, here is Minecraft Hospital. Guys, you can see this is the hospital in Brookhaven as compared to the hospital in Minecraft. They look pretty similar, guys. Except for it's raining really hard here. Molly, help! Daisy, where are you? Are you inside the hospital? Do you need a doctor? No, Molly, I'm in the graveyard. You're in the graveyard without me? Why'd you do that? There could have been a zombie or an angry mob. Molly, I'm stuck down in this grave and I can't get out. <laughs> into Roblox so I can do the laugh emoji. Molly, <laughs> would you stop laughing at me? I need your help down here. Okay, guys, my sister needs my help to try to get out of this grave. Um, but I'm a noob, so I'm not really sure I can help you. What do you want me to do? Stop hitting me, Molly! Oh, sorry. Um, let me see if I have, like, a step ladder in here. Molly, you don't have a step ladder. Um, yes, I do, Daisy. Yes, I do. You do, Molly? Molly, you're my hero. <laughs> do, 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 do. Thanks, Molly. Ha, and you thought I was a total Minecraft noob. Try not to fall down into that grave again, okay? Uh, noted, Molly, definitely. I'm gonna fill it in with dirt. And that way, no one ever falls in there again. Um, alright guys, while my sister's filling in that, I want to go see if there's anything else cool to see inside this amazing Minecraft Brookhaven. Let's go into the hospital. Whoa, this looks much different than Roblox Brookhaven. I mean, it, it looks the same, but there's like no beds or anything. I really like Brookhaven in Minecraft, and I really like Brookhaven in um, Roblox too. 
I think they'd both be fun to play. What's that sound? Ah! It's a bat! There's, there's so many bats in this Minecraft hospital! This is totally different than Roblox, Brookhaven. There's never any bats in there. Somebody locked the door with these, with these bats everywhere! Ah! Oh, okay, um, alright, uh, let's get out of here. <laughs> Molly, there's probably more bats outside. What? No, I don't see any bats. Molly, back up before they get you. Oh, they're following me. Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. All right, let's run back to our house. And, um, hopefully we can survive this bat invasion. Molly, we have a little bit more to talk in here. There's a lot of cave spiders in this book even in Minecraft. Yep, that's it. Chase Daisy. Go ahead, chase her. Chase her. Oh, very funny, Molly. <laughs> I think it's hilarious. Oh, man. Daisy, they're after you. The bats, too. <laughs> None of the mobs in this Brookhaven in Minecraft likes Daisy. Oh, God. Take me back to Brookhaven in Roblox. Ah! <laughs> that was so much fun. Oh, yeah. So much. I got chased by cave spiders and bats and... Ay, ay, ay. Yeah, but you have to admit, that Brookhaven in Minecraft was pretty cool. Yeah, it was pretty cool. Except for the part where I get chased by all those mobs. <laughs> hey guys, thanks so much for watching. If you would like to see Daisy and I play more Minecraft, please slam that like button. And let us know in the comments section below. Guys, we read all of your comments, and we can't wait to see what you have to say to us about our Minecraft adventure today. All right, guys, we'll see you next time. Hopefully without a bunch of spiders chasing me. Bye, guys! <laughs>
1999. Ugh. Ooh. Everything here costs so much money. Um, how about like these tennis rackets? $21.99? I only have $9. Perfect! Look it. Baby Kira would love one of these bouncy balls. This is what I'll get her. La 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 la. Are you all ready to check out? Yep. How much is it? That one is $9.99. What? No! I only have $9. Can it please be just $9? Oh, I'm sorry, but that's not how the real world works. That's exactly how the real world should work. I can't afford to get my sister anything. Oh, I'm really sorry about that. This sounds like a real problem. Oh, my sister's going to be so disappointed in me. I'm her biggest sister, and I didn't even get her anything for her, for her birthday. I'm the worst big sister ever. Oh. I guess there's only one thing to do. Yum, 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 yum. Ah, oh, this cookie's so good. Oh, give me a cupcake, too. Whoa, girl, you need to slow down. You're gonna get a tummy ache. No, I need to eat everything inside Starbucks. Well, everything that $9 will buy. Yum, 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 yum. This is Starbucks. It's not gonna really buy that much. You need like a cookie and a half a cupcake. Fine! Give me the half a cupcake! Nobody knows the trouble I've seen. Oh. How am I gonna tell my baby sister I don't have a present? What is that? Ugh. It's a... It's a... A doll? Man, that looks like it's been out here a while. It's all dirty and tattered. But maybe I could give it some love. Clean it up some and give it to my sister for her birthday. I mean, a doll is a doll, right? I think she'll love it. Oh, I think I think she'll really like you. At least I hope she does. Because if not, I don't have another birthday present for baby Kira. Ow! I'm going to call you Susie. Susie Q. Aww. Okay, Susie Q. Time to get you cleaned up so I can give you to my sister for her birthday. You probably haven't had a bath in, well... Smell like about 10 years. <laughs> yeah. I just can't believe someone abandoned you. You need love too, even if you are, well, a little bit ugly. Hopefully I can get all the dirt off of you. Or at least make you smell better. <laughs> oh, I know. I'll use some of Daisy's really expensive shampoo. I'm sure she won't mind. I mean, it is for a good cause, baby Kira's birthday and all. I can't believe my sister bought this. I mean, I know it was expensive and all, but this bottle of shampoo looks, well, ridiculous. <laughs> anyway, um, here you go, Susie Q. Let's uh, just put some of this in here. Try to get all of that yucky dirt out of your hair. Five minutes later. That didn't seem to work at all. You still look, well, ugly. Hopefully my sister baby Kira doesn't think so, because her birthday's in five minutes and, well, I don't have any other choice. You have to be good enough, Susie Q doll. I hope baby Kira can see past your, well, creepy look. Ah! Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Kira. My mom always has to make the song so beautiful. Aww. Birthday to you! <laughs> you belong at the zoo. I don't need to, like, make my song pretty at all. I always make mine silly and kind of, well, crazy. Well, that goes with your personality then, Molly. Okay, who's ready for promotions? I got presents I want! Molly, did you get your sister a present? Of course I did! Be right back! <coughs> Sorry, I didn't have time to wrap it. Um, and also I didn't have enough money for wrapping paper, but I put it in a box! Oh, I got big bread! I love it! Okay, everybody, I'm Snapchatting this, so make sure you say happy birthday! Happy birthday, baby Kira! You're the cutest little sister in the world. I know, right? She really is cute. Look at her with her little passy. Give me plenty! <coughs> baby Kira, say please. That's not nice. You might not want it anyway, baby Q. It might be like a half-eaten chocolate chip cookie. Hey, who wouldn't want a half-eaten chocolate chip cookie for their birthday? I wouldn't mind. 
It's just so sad your dad is on a work trip. Ah, but he'll see this on Snapchat. Yeah, we miss you, Dad! Okay, baby Kara, open up the box. Open it, open it! I, I can't wait to open it. It could be amazing. It's a, it's a doll! Well, Mom, I think it's adorable. Um, yeah, okay. I love it! <laughs> what? She's so cute, I love it! You do? Well, she's not perfect, but she needs a home. And you could be her mommy. Aww. Let's be friends. <laughs> she talks! I never heard that she talked before. I didn't even replace her batteries. I'm so glad it didn't get ruined in the bath. Well, um, as long as baby Kira loves that doll, I agree with mom. She's a little bit weird looking. She's just old, okay? And she needs a mommy. She needs somebody to love her. That could be you, baby Kira. I love her. I want her. I can see my birthday doll. I named her Susie. Susie Q. I got it. Hi, Susie Q. Let's be friends. Okay, we be friends. Hey everybody, I just got done celebrating my baby sister's um, birthday and I really bought her, well I didn't buy her, I actually found this doll. She really loved it though, um, even though my mom and sister thought it was kind of creepy. Hey, hey over there! Who's on the background of my Snapchat? Alright, I'm just going to turn it around and see what is going on right now. I'm like, I don't know where I am. I'm like confused on my Snapchat. There she is. Um, why is somebody hopping over my fence? All right, guys, I'll see you later. I gotta find out who this is. Well, oh, hi. Um, my parents just bought the house next door to you. I'm Hannah. Oh, hey, Hannah. I'm Molly. Um, I think we're gonna be in the same grade together, and I was wondering if you wanted to like hang out. Yeah, sure. Come on in. The door's over here into the fence. Okay, be right there. Whoa! I'm gonna make a new friend today! This is gonna be awesome! Hi! Nice to meet you. I'm Hannah. I'm Molly. Um, what are you doing? Open your door, silly. <laughs> I thought maybe I had a dog or something. I don't want him to get out. Good point. I always forget to do that. Ow! Whoa, your backyard is so amazing! OMG. Uh, sorry, I have the hiccups. <laughs> I just drank a huge glass of lemonade. Ooh, jealous! That sounds delicious! So, um, tell me about yourself. Where'd you come from? Oh, Malibu. Whoa. Wow. Fancy. Yeah. But I'm really liking this new town. Everybody seems so nice. Whoa, what was that sound? Um, it was my stomach. Sorry, I think I ate too much birthday cake. I'll be right back, okay? Sure, no problem. I'll wait here for you. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, oh thank goodness the door wasn't locked. <laughs> Where did that doll come from? I don't remember that being in Molly's yard. It's kind of creepy, but it's probably hers or her sister's or something. Hmm, it looks like it's gonna rain soon. Maybe I should take you inside so you don't get ruined more than you already are. Let's Ah! What's wrong with that doll? Oh, why did I eat so much cake? Such a bad idea. Such a bad idea! Uh-oh. Just need the plunger for that one. <laughs> yeah. Hannah, I'm back. Let's hang out some more. Hannah? Hannah? Oh. Okay, there one of two things has happened. One, I spent too much time in the potty and she left. <laughs> or two, she didn't really like me and she left. <gasps> oh. Hey. What's Baby Kira's doll doing out here? It looks like it's gonna rain soon. Ugh, baby Kira must have left her out here. Come on, Susie Q. I bet Baby Kira is wondering where you are. I don't know why Hannah just ran away from me. She like disappeared. I thought she could be my friend, but I guess she just didn't want to be. Oh, hey, Molly. Why, why are you frowning? Did you have a bad day after baby Kira's birthday? She loved the doll, honey. No worries about only having a few dollars to buy her birthday present. Mom, no. This new neighbor Hannah came to hang out with me, 
And I had to run in to go to the bathroom, and when I came back, she just disappeared. Or maybe she got a call from her mom and had to go home. I'm sure it wasn't because of you, Molly. You're a really good friend. You're probably right. Thanks, Mom. Love you, sweetheart. Have a great night's sleep. Thanks, Mom. Let's be friends. What? What? Why is that doll going off right now? I could have swore that I turned her off. Let's be friends. Why am I so freaked out right now and scared? It's just a dumb doll. Besides, she's just old. She's probably broken. Her off button doesn't work. I bet baby Kira is missing you, Susie Q. Come on. I'll put you in her bed with her. Oh, baby Kira, I hope you had the best birthday ever. I need to stop being so silly about that doll. <laughs> that was ridiculous. <laughs> morning. Oh, maybe she's already out there waiting for me. Molly, are you out here? Molly! Where did she go? Oh, I bet she went to Starbucks to get some coffee. Hey, are those feet I see hanging out below the, the bushes? Oh my god! Why is there somebody in our bushes sleeping? Molly? What happened to Molly? And who is that girl? Molly, wake up! Molly, you were in the backyard in the bushes. And, and what's going on right now? It looked like you got knocked down the head. I think I did. Oh my god. Molly, it was that creepy doll. Who's this girl? She's the neighbor. The new neighbor, Hannah. That creepy doll. She knocked us on the head and dragged us out here. <gasps> what creepy doll? You been baby Kira's creepy doll? Are you guys pranking me right now? This isn't funny. No, we're not pranking you. I'm not the type of person that would prank anybody. I, I, I have a really bad headache. That doll chased me and then bonked me on top of the head. Ooh. Yeah, and, and that was so crazy. It chased me like super fast and it had a knife and I tried to run, but whammo. Oh my God, are you kidding me? You okay, Hannah? I think so. I just have a little bit of a headache from the bonk. Molly, are you okay? Should I call that one? No, I'm okay, but we need to get rid of that doll. And quick. Yeah, and we should Snapchat it all so that no one ever tries to adopt that doll ever again. I'm really sorry I brought it into our house. I didn't know. It wasn't your fault, Molly. How could you know? I think we should... Like, take the doll out into the woods and bury it six feet deep. <laughs> good idea, Molly. Goodbye and good readings. Whoa, there's way too much drama in this neighborhood. I'm sorry, but good luck. We can't be friends. <laughs> Wait, what? Hannah? Whoa, she jumped over the fence. She was totally freaked out, and I don't think she wants to be our friend anymore. Ugh. Hey, guys, it's Molly. A Daisy. We're making this Snapchat way now. Because, well, there's a creepy, evil doll that has moved into our house. It really wasn't my fault. I didn't know. Well, um, you brought it home, but yeah, you didn't know. Oh, my God. We have to get rid of it, guys. But we wanted to make this Snapchat so you knew the doll was evil. Do not dig it up. Oh, wait, Molly. Let's go get it from baby Kira and bury it six feet deep in the woods. Good idea. Baby Kira! Right now! I'm not fooling you! Let's be friends! Let's yeah. not, evil psycho doll! Why are you talking to me about my doll? That's not nice! Yeah. Girls, be nice to your sister! Uh oh! Well, we will, Mom! Baby Kira, listen to me. That doll bonked me over the head, chasing me with a knife, and threw me in the bushes along with the new neighbor, Hannah. 
right now if we did it, I'd gobble your prank. Let's be friends. Psycho doll, be quiet! Quit talking to my doll like that. I love her. I love her. Do you love her as much as... Ice cream? It's your favorite watermelon. Oh, watermelon. <gasps> Sorry, doll. I want the ice cream. Give it to me, please, please, please. Aww. Okay, baby Kira. Um, great. You eat that ice cream. All right, creepy evil doll. Time to bear. Molly, that sounded kind of crazy. You want to sound a little less psycho? I mean, the doll's a psycho one, boy. Okay, D you're not really alive. You're just evil. And we're about to dare bury you in the dirt. Let's be friends. Yeah, okay, psycho. I don't think so. Get in, Molly. Don't take your eye off that psycho doll. Don't worry, Daisy. I won't. Should we listen to some music? I've got some Halloween songs. Aw, uh, Daisy! No, this is creepy enough. We don't need the Halloween songs. Ow! You sure? I think it could kind of lend to the ambiance. Daisy! What? It's a creepy Snapchat movie. We need creepy tunes. Daisy, what are we doing here? I thought we said the woods. Yeah, but I think the cemetery is creepy. Okay, my sister wants to make this as creepy as possible. So, um, yeah, let's grab our shovels. Okay, you dig while I Snapchat this. Molly, we nope. both have to dig. There's a lot of dirt here. Oh, gosh. You're right. This is way too much work. The evil doll is just going to have to live with us. What? Molly, quit being so lazy and keep digging. Uh, is the hole deep enough yet? Not quite, Molly. Keep digging. Hey, guys. It's me, Molly, again. And my sister and I are in the graveyard. We just dug a giant hole, and we're about to drop this evil Let's Be Friends doll inside of it. Guys, whatever you do, do not dig up this doll! Molly, it's time. Let's do this. Easy, that was the last of the dirt. Good. She's six feet under now. See you later, evil, evil doll. Let's see if we hear her say Let's Be Friends. Daisy, I don't hear anything. Perfect! She's gone! Now come on, let's go home. I need some lemonade. You're speaking my language, Daisy. Daisy, what's up with the creepy music? We buried the doll! Sorry, it was still on from when we were driving over here. Is this music better? Yes, absolutely! Remind me never to pick up a creepy broken doll on the way from Starbucks again. Yeah, Molly. Don't ever do that again, please. Well, I guess it's time to go to bed. Daisy? Yes, Molly, what is it? Um, uh, are you too afraid to sleep by yourself, Molly? Uh, yeah, me too. Wanna sleep in my room with me? Yeah, what if that creepy doll comes back? No way, Molly. That doll is history. Ugh, I hope so. It is, Molly. It is. And uh, we'll be here together. Yeah. Feeling much safer now. Good morning, Molly! Oh, what? Where's the doll? Where's the doll? Molly, there is no doll. We got rid of her. And we survived the whole night. And it never came back. We're rid of that doll forever. Thank goodness everybody in town is too. Yeah, you could say that again. Phew, so relieved. Oh, boy, Mommy, is that my birthday present from Amazon? Yes, honey, it was delivered today. Oh, I can't wait to open it. Thank you so much, Mom. You're welcome. I'm so excited. I know you're going to love this. Say cheese, honey. You're on Snapchat. Cheese. Wait, that's not the doll I ordered from Amazon. What is that creepy thing? Let's be friends. Oh, no. Not again. Not math class. Yes, Molly. Math class. What am I Oh, I don't want to. There's too many days of school. Molly, we 
I've been in school for two days. It's the beginning of the new school year. Already I want summer vacation again. Already! Uh, Molly, just try to collect the pencils if you're going to escape. Why? Because you're going to need to be homeschooled if you don't want to be schooled here. And you'll need the pencils. All right, I got one pencil. Is that good? Sure, Molly. Not really. You probably should just pay attention in math so you don't turn into an ignoramus. Congratulations! Now you can escape math class and get detention for the rest of the year. Well, that'll probably be my fate, but it'll be worth it. Can we sneak into the cafeteria before we go home, though? I heard today's pizza day, and I'm really hungry. Ay, 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 Molly. Ah, what are we going to do with you? <laughs> Think I'm the coolest girl in the whole world? No, Molly, math is important. You're right. Math is very important. Ah, <gasps> but it hurts my brain. Um, okay. I didn't think that they were actually going to come out, but they did. Whee! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, I died in the spikes. I mean, they put those fans there. Yeah, but it didn't work really good. It's asking me if I want to buy Robux. No, what I'd like to do is survive. <laughs> Can you help me do that? Whoa. Oh, no. No, guys, don't say that. think that I'm saying that math isn't important. Math is important. Pay attention in school, okay? This is just a role play on Roblox. Don't send me hate messages. So today we're going to pretend that we're going to escape math. Yeah, except for that time that you really did go to the cafeteria and get a piece of pizza, Molly. Don't even lie about it. Well, math makes me use a lot of brain cells. And that makes me really hungry. But I still did my homework. Yes, she did. After she ate all of her pizza, of course. Having a full stomach when you go to school is very important. Wait a minute, I missed the elevator somehow. A few hours later. Okay, I guess you gotta push the button while you're on the elevator. All right, there we go. Duh! Well, that was an ignorant most move. Molly, watch it, this is electrified. Got it. Boing, 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 whoa! Also, you can fall down between the pipes. That would be crazy. Let's not do that. Ah, I got something in my eye. Hold on. Molly, you're delaying the game. I know, but I can't help it. I got something in my eye in real life. Okay, there we go. It may have been a bug. Ew, a bug got in your eye? That's so gross. Hey, this stuff happens sometimes. Why is it that bugs are so attracted to your eyeball? I mean, what's in there? Moisture, Molly. Really? They want to drink the moisture from your eyeball? Okay, that's disgusting. And how come they only put the pencils where they want you to buy stuff? I think that's a dirty, rotten trick is what I think. So far, I don't see this math teacher. Where is he? He's probably chasing you as you s think about that right now. No, he's not. Oh, I guess he is. Ew, he's got nose hairs. Gross. Molly, quit killing about that and just run. O-M-G. Okay, let's get out of here, guys. Holy macaroni. I don't know which way to go. I'm following this other girl. She seems like she's a grade or two ahead of me. She's a lot taller than me. So she probably knows where she's going. And I do not. So the math teacher's chasing me. And I just need to get out of here really, really quickly. Oh, yeah. Look, at he's standing back there. O-M-G. Uh, which way are we supposed to go? I think this way and then onto the trampoline. Oh, there's a pencil over there. I'm going to get that pencil. You know I am, guys. You know I'm going to collect all ten pencils. If it's the last thing I do. Wow. E for effort, Molly. Thank you. Who's throwing stuff at me? Who is throwing stuff at me? Oh, nothing, Molly. I think that's just shooting out of that hole over there. All right, let's wait till this one actually shoots out the ball. And then I'm going to run. And I'm going to be patient and wait because I don't know. Okay, I think it stopped. Phew. Ah! Oh, I made it. Yay. And then I immediately Ooh. died. You can become the math teacher. Uh, 199 Robux to become the math teacher. Holy macaroni, that's a lot of money to become the evil math teacher. No thanks. I don't, I don't think so. I think I got past that ball part even though I died. The game just saved me after it. I love when that happens. It is awesome. Is this going to go to my freedom, guys? No. This math teacher has calculated how to keep me in school forever. Wait for the spikes. Wait for them. If you step on them, they will kill you. Guys, if you played this game before, slam the like button if you have. Or if you want to play it, you can slam the like button too. I just got killed. I don't know how though. Okay, um, I didn't actually die. Well, that was good. Oh, it's a slime! <laughs> oh my gosh, I wish I had one of these in my school. Uh, except for the part where I exploded at the end. And I, what? I turned into a noob? Ha 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 ha! Molly turned into a noob! Whatever, Daisy. You were a noob in the last game. Yeah, well... 
No one thinks about that. They're only watching this one. And in this one, Molly's a noob. <laughs> um, I may be a noob, but I'm still amazing. Uh, guys, if you turn into a noob, don't want to get you down. You're still amazing. You're still yourself. You're just a noob on Roblox. Whoa, it's taken us 11 minutes and 30 seconds so far. Oh, wait, no, I think that's counting down. Oh, our time is 493 seconds. That's to get a free pass, so I was actually wrong about that. Whoa, let's turn this off. We don't want any waste falling on our heads. That's gross. Do you think there's going to be an epic boss battle in this one? I don't know, but I just saw the math teacher and he looks angry. Um, yeah, he's got a skateboard. Whoa, is he going to hit us with that skateboard? Or is he going to ride on it? I don't know if he's going to ride on it. Stop doing math. Numbers were... Not supposed to be given names. Okay, I, I couldn't read all the sign. I wish I could, guys. Sure, it's really funny, but... Ah! Why won't the door open? Holy guacamole. Oh, he's just standing out there. Whew. That's good. We gotta move all these pallets, Daisy, before he comes in here. This is a lot of pallets. This is annoying. Yeah, what do I look like? I'm not even supposed to be doing weightlifting today. Today? Have you been doing weightlifting other times? Yeah, I've been trying to get really buff. <laughs> Daisy, you're more of into a science... Science nerd type thing. I'm a nerd. I'm not even ashamed to admit it. But I definitely want to be the buffest nerd in my entire school. Well, that's a good goal, Daisy. That's a good goal. Come on, Molly. Let's go. We have to escape math. Yeah, because I definitely want to go home and have an after school snack. And chill in front of the TV for a little bit. And then do your homework. Yeah, sure. Do my homework. Yeah, exactly. What are these? Those are something we used to throw. Ooh, what a target. Fun. Did Daisy get it on the first try? Oh, so did I. Cool. Do, 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 do. Molly, there probably is going to be an epic boss back here. Just know this. Uh, no, there's just more block building. I really thought it was going to be an epic boss. Nope. Oh, Daisy, I think I just stuck you inside the box. I'm sorry about that. Molly, let me out of here. What are you doing? Guess you're stuck in math class. Where, 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 where? Oh, my gosh, guys. Molly put me in this box and I can't get out. Oh, Daisy had to reset. Oh, poor Daisy. I can't believe you trapped me in that box, Molly. That was rude. <laughs> Sorry, I don't mean to laugh, but... <laughs> oh, I snorted a little bit. It was so funny. <laughs> Molly! <laughs> okay, I'm done laughing. <laughs> um, Guys, let's see how far ahead we can get from Daisy. Because I trapped her in that box and I think it's kind of funny. She's always like, I'm so much better at Roblox than you. Well, let's see how good you are now. Trapped her in a box. Now I'm like in the sewer trying to escape this crazy math teacher. And I'm doing pretty good so far, actually. Whoa, a pencil, guys. Super excited about that. Uh, Oh, another vent. There's so many vents in this. It's because if you want to escape school, you have to go up into the vent to get out. Oh, and rotten corpses. Whoa, you're ready for Halloween. Oh, yeah, she's. She definitely is. She's part zombie. Oh my god, guys. Daisy is right behind us. We're gonna drink this Blacksy Cola and quick. How'd she catch up to us so fast? Because normally I go slower just to try to make you feel better about yourself, Molly. What? Oh my gosh, I didn't know that. Um, you can't just stand here and drink all the Blacksy Colas. Whoa, I almost made the same mistake twice. But I didn't. Holy macaroni. This is harder than it looks. Whoa. You cannot speed run through all of this. You really have to take your time or you will die. Then you have to start all the way back over. And that stinks. Boing. Boing. Holy moly, guys. Holy moly. Did we beat Daisy again? Awesome. Oh, guys, I'm only one pencil short. And then guess what? I'm going to be a winner, winner, chicken dinner. Ah, and then I got fried. Woohoo, I made it. I'm getting so frustrated with this game. If you hear me sighing on the, the camera, it's because I'm like, seriously, this game is annoying me. Now, now, Daisy. Don't get frustrated or you're not allowed to play Roblox anymore. Or maybe a better punishment would be um, for Daisy that she couldn't do her homework. Oh, um, gee, look at all these lasers, guys. They're definitely going to try to kill me. That's what these lasers like to do. Whoa! 
Getting dizzy. Getting dizzy with it. Do, 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 do. Oh, and then I'm going back down. Okay, guys. I don't know what is happening right now. Oh, I get to climb a rock wall? Are you serious? Okay, that's pretty cool. I think that's the first time I've done that in an obby. Or the first time in, like, a long time, because I don't remember it. Ah! Yes! Uh-oh. Epic boss battle. Bam, 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 bam. You're going down, math teacher. Oh, whoa, he throws, like, giant lava boulders at you. Okay, that's a little rude. Oh, Dizzy finally showed up for the party. Nice to see ya. Oh, wow. Come on now. Ow! He sets out like a giant trap for you. Whoa, whoa, here it comes. Here comes this giant flaming lava rocks or whatever. Oh, um, gee, you're going down. Ah! Don't you dare. Don't you dare kill me at the last minute. No! I want to take you down in one try. Oh, he's like right behind me. Oh! Yes, guys! I did it in one try. I'm so excited about that. Wait, how did Daisy get a, a flying cloud? I'm just amazing like that. Um, guys, I don't know if this is going to take me to the end or not, but I guess we're about to find out. It did! And we got a badge. Dun, 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 dun. You won, badge. Go us, Daisy. Well, I mean, go me. I definitely beat you. You did not. I, I beat him before you did. And I got a magic cloud, too. Whoa, there's a um, Ferris wheel over here and stuff. I want to get on that. Come on, Daisy. Does it work? I don't know, Molly. Oh, it does work. Oh, this is so much fun. I'm glad we played this game. Oh, my God. You can see. Like, look, guys. You can see the whole game underneath us. Hey, guys. Thanks so much for watching today. Yeah, we love you guys. You're the best fans in the world. And we'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys. <laughs>
I have my job promotion today. Well, correction. I might not actually get the promotion, but... Ah, get in the car! But I didn't brush my teeth yet! Brush them at school! I didn't eat breakfast! Yeah, I don't know. I eat lunch when you get to school. But lunch isn't breakfast and I'll be hungry. Molly, I cannot be late for work today. Hurry, Molly, get in. Oh, no, I forgot my homework. Are you serious? Yeah, and if I don't go get it, I'm going to get detention. You don't want that, do you? Ugh, Molly, hurry. Oh, no, oh, no. I don't want to be late for my promotion. Oh, this kid always makes me late for work. Ah! Now, where did I put my homework? The last time I had it, I was getting a snack out of the refrigerator. <laughs> uh, did I leave it in there? No, but ooh, leftover pizza. <clears throat> Delicious. OMG, what is taking her so long? Molly! What? Uh, Molly! Oh my God, did you find your homework? Um, uh, Molly, it's up in your room. Take the pizza to go. Sorry, mom. I bet you are. You're always sorry when you make me late for work, but today is kind of important. Come on, Molly. Coming. Oh, no. I forgot my teddy bear. What? Your teddy bear? What do you need a teddy bear for? Um, It was bring your teddy bear to school day. Mom, well, Mom, you're being kind of crazy with your driving right now. You'll have to take your teddy bear to school some other time. I cannot be late for this job promotion. Mom, stop saying. Whoopsie. <laughs> I totally paused. Mom, do you even know the way to my school? Yes, I know the way to your school. Hey, there's Daisy. Hey, get out. Mom, you just ran into the building. Um, Yeah, my driving isn't that good this morning because I'm in a hurry. Bruh. Love you. Have a great day. Oh, no, my car Bruh. is stuck. Ah, okay, there we go. Molly, what have you been doing? What were you doing? You just got here. No, Molly, I didn't. I actually took the trash out for the teacher. Ugh. You're such a goody two-shoes. Whoa, I drove right past the hospital. Can you guys tell that I'm a little bit nervous? Good morning, Susie. Oh, good morning, Laura. You're late again. Oh, I know, but uh, my daughter, she's just... You better go in and see him. He's waiting for you in his office. Oh, my gosh. Here we go. I bet he's going to give me the promotion. Ah, I'm so excited. Good morning, Laura. Oh, good morning, Mr. Glenn. I'm so glad you called me into your office. I'm really excited this morning. And very late. Oh, sorry about that. <laughs> My daughter Molly, she's, uh, well, a little bit of trouble, but she's a good kid. She, she, she is a good kid. Uh-huh, yes. Um, but here at this job, we have expectations. Yes, and I always meet the expectations with the patients. Uh-huh, so I have something that I need to talk to you about. Ah, uh, yes, I, I agree, and I'm really excited. You are? Yeah, this is going to be an amazing opportunity. Um, yeah, starting over can be an opportunity. Yep, a new position. Uh-huh, well, we're going to miss you here at the hospital. Huh? Miss me at the hospital? Wait, does this promotion mean I'm going to be working at a different location? No, what promotion? I'm not giving you a promotion. Wait, weren't we just talking about the promotion? I was going to be making an extra $50 an hour. No, you're not getting a promotion. You're, you're getting fired. Wait, what? F -f 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 fired I've been working at this job for years, sir. Why am I getting fired? I don't understand. You've been late every single day for almost a month. That's because my daughter Molly, she never gets to the bus on time. I always have to drive her to school. Well, whatever the reason, we need somebody who's dependable here for this job position. So we are, well, firing you. Firing me? F -f 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 firing me? Ah! Hey, honey, you're home. How was the promotion? Did they take the picture? Did they post it on the news? Wow, must have been mind blowing. <laughs> Honey, are are you okay? <laughs> You're so excited, aren't you? <laughs> Honey, what's going on? You're freaking me out right now. I, I, I got fired. Wait, what? You got fired for what? 
been at that job forever! Plus, we need that money to help pay our bills. I... I was late again. Wait, why? Because Molly didn't get out of bed like I asked her to when I had to drive her to school. That's it. She's grounded for the rest of her life. I... I don't know what I'll do. I've always worked at the hospital. I love working at the hospital. And now I'm fired! <laughs> okay, honey. It's okay. Don't, don't cry. You're a very smart woman. You could get a job anywhere, and there's lots of businesses here. Tomorrow morning, you can start off looking for a new job. I'm sure you'll find something amazing. I... I hope so. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. I'm just making this Snapchat because I had a terrible day yesterday. I got fired from my job, but as you can see, I'm still smiling right now because... Today is a new day. It's actually so early in the day that um, the sun hasn't even come up yet, but I'm determined to find a new career today. So guys, wish me luck. Well, here goes nothing. I think I saw that the bank was hiring. Yeah, totally on my list. All right, let's go over to the bank and see if I can get a job there. That'd be a really good job to have. Good morning, welcome to Keep Safe Bank. How can I help you today? Oh, hi. Uh, I saw that you were interviewing for new new um, bank tellers. Oh, yes. Come right into my little office here. <laughs> Nothing fancy at the bank. Except for all the money. That's pretty fancy. Yeah. <laughs> I'm pretty good with money, actually. I have so much in my savings account because uh, I had a steady job for 10 years. I mean, steady as can be. Oh, that's good to hear. You sound reliable. Um, do you have any banking um, experience? Uh, yes, I go in every Friday to cash my check. Oh, I meant like, have you worked in banking? Did you go to college for it? Uh, no. Well, what did you do for 10 years then? I worked at the hospital. Oh, sorry, hospitals and banks are a lot different. Can't work here. Oh, okay, thank you for your time, bye. Hopefully you'll get another check though so you can come back on Friday. Uh, no, I can't. I got fired. Whoa, harsh. Well, good luck with the job search. Thank you. Oh, man. Okay, that's okay. It's just one job that I didn't get. I'm sure I can find something else. According to my list, Pop Palace is hiring. They have rare exotic pets. Do they call hamsters rare and exotic? I could totally do this job. Love hamsters and dogs and cats. Welcome. Please wait for the staff. Okay, well, are you staff? Yes, but we have to say that because sometimes our animals get a little crazy and they think they can talk to us. <laughs> <laughs> oh, very funny. Hey, I'm looking for a job. This seems like a great place to me. Whoa. <laughs> What's that over there? Lady, if you've never seen a monkey before, you probably shouldn't be working here. Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to say what's that. I knew it was a monkey, but you guys have a pet monkey? Yeah, he's so crazy. Sometimes he likes to throw poo-poo at yeah. the customers. <laughs> You're so funny. No, for real. Watch out! What? Ew, it landed on my head! Sorry about that. I told you the monkey was kind of crazy. OMG! Ew, why is it blue? This monkey loves blueberries. <laughs> you get it? What? Um, yeah, I don't want to work here. But you'd be great at the job! He loves you! No, thank you! Oh, this job search is not going so well. Park is hiring and, well, I need to work somewhere. Now, where is the manager? Yo, what's up? You looking for a job? Ugh, I'm a little frazzled right now, but hey, why you got to poop on your head? Oh, no, I forgot to wipe that off! Excuse me. I'll just use my phone like a mirror, that way I can see it. And oh my god, I'm on Snap! And I just sent it to everybody! Oh my gosh, I didn't mean to do that. Oopsie, having the worst day ever. <laughs> I'm sorry, but that was kind of funny. <laughs> Whoa, what happened to you? Uh, I was just doing a little maintenance on one of the pieces of uh, amusement park ride equipment, and um, things didn't go quite as I planned. So, um, do you have any uh, experience? Uh, no, I'm not really into amusement parks, but I'm super smart, and, um, I'm sure I can do this. Okay, well, we have one rule before you get hired here. Okay, I'm sure I can meet it. What is it? You actually have to ride the rides to make sure that you're excited about the job. What? What? Why? 
because we're all about bringing fun to everyone here. And if you're not having fun, our customers won't be having fun. <gasps> Go ahead, get on the roller coaster. Um, I'm not really a big roller coaster person. I hope you didn't just say that, because you're not going to get hired. Okay, fine. I'll get on the roller coaster. Fine. Enjoy your ride. It's probably going to be super fun and stuff. Yeah. <laughs> yep, it sure will be if you really like the roller coasters. Yep. Oh, boy. Okay, just try not to lose your lunch, Laura. Keep from throwing up. Nope, I'm definitely gonna. Oh, no. <laughs> Yeah, you can't work here. Well, at least get me off of here. Sorry, it's a 10 minute ride. Ah! Just kidding, get off the ride. Also, you're not a good candidate. Oh, I think I might have left some throw up in your car. That's all right, I'll take care of it. Sorry. God, I'm out of job options. We're gonna be homeless. Ah! Well, I guess there's only one choice left. Hey, what can I get for you? <laughs> McDonald's, by the way. Oh, hi. Um, can I speak to your manager, please? Why? What happened? Did you get like, um, like a rat in your French fries or something? <laughs> what? No. I just am looking for a job. I need the manager. I want to speak to them about getting a job. Well, you're speaking to the manager. What? You're like 16 years old. You still have a bunch of pimples. How can you be the manager? Well, get used to it, lady, because you'd be working for me if you want a job at McDonald's. Ow! Ugh. Seriously? I'm working for a teenager? Ugh. So, do you want the job or not? We're a bit short-handed, and I could use somebody right now. drive through is getting crazy. Well, I guess so. I need a job. And it's better than being homeless. Well, come on back here. I'll get you a uniform. Don't forget to say welcome to McDonald's. Okay. <laughs> when is this uniform what they wear at McDonald's? Oh, we just got that updated uh, about a week ago. <laughs> you look awesome and a little bit old in that uh, Happy Meal <laughs> hat. I mean, what are you, like 50? What? No, I'm not 50. Well, like I'm just saying, you're not like 15 or 16. No, I'm not. I should be the manager of this place. Okay, here's the drive through window. Make sure you're polite, you say hello. You didn't do that. Well, yeah, okay, but I'm the manager. I get to do what I want. Ugh. Take a look around the place, though. Make sure you know what everything, where everything is. I see that. Okay, fine. Oh, I can't believe I'm working at McDonald's drive through How embarrassing that I'm a grown-up and having to wear this silly hat. Dad, I really want to have a Happy Meal. Okay, Molly, okay. And Dad, also, what's going on with your stash? I mean, that's new. Just trying something different. It looks like you have a caterpillar on your upper lip. <laughs> Very funny, Molly. Hi. Welcome to McDonald's. What can I get for you? Mom? What are you doing? And what are you wearing? <laughs> Is this some kind of joke? Actually, I would be really careful what you say to your mom because you're kind of the reason why she's working here. And what? Why are you working at McDonald's? I couldn't get any other job. And I didn't want us to be homeless. Oh, honey. I'm sure something else will come along, but for now, you do look pretty cute in that Happy Meal hat. Oh. Oh, I feel so dumb! Okay, well, um, anyway, enough talking. Come on, do your job. What? Yeah, uh, Molly wants a Happy Meal, and I would like a Big Mac meal, please. Okay, fine. We love you, honey. Have a good shift. Yeah, thank you. Hey everyone, it's me, Laura. I can't believe I'm actually making this Snapchat right now. So I'm su super embarrassed by this, but I'm wearing a Happy Meal on my head. It even has two chicken nuggets on the sides and fries <coughs> on the back. I feel ridiculous. Please just say something nice to me so that I feel better because I'm having a terrible day. Okay, bye. Oh, yay. Another customer. Okay, just try to be friendly, Laura, even though you hate your life right now. Hello? Are you going to take my order? Um, yes, but could you get a little closer to the window? It's it's really far away. I'm not going to be able to hand you your food like that, please. Oh, how rude. I can't believe you're talking to me like that. Uh, well, I, I can't reach you from all the way over there, and I want to be able to hand you your food. Like, you know, I don't want to drop your chicken nuggets on the ground. Fine, I'll back up. You need to <gasps> 
Lord's cheese. Um, okay. <sighs> breathe, 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 okay. Hi, welcome to McDonald's. Um, what can I get for you today? How about a better attitude? I mean, every time I come through here, there's somebody that's grumpy. Oh, sorry about that. Um, what can I get for you? I'll have a 20 piece chicken McNuggets with french fries and um, a Coke. Okay, um, sure. Um, that would be $35. What? $35? When did the prices at McDonald's go so high? Um, about four years ago or so. Oh, I can't believe this. McDonald's isn't even like what I really wanted. Well, you could always go to Burger King across the street. Just give me my order. Okay, fine. Bacon, is the order up yet? No. I was busy making a Snapchat. Oh, yeah, but this lady, she really wants her food, and I really want her gone. She's really miserable. Hey, listen, Happy Meal Head, I'll get it done when I get it done. Okay. I'm sorry, ma'am, but um, your order's taking a little longer than normal. Could you please pull up? What? You want me to pull up? Ugh, this is so annoying. Sorry, uh, it's just you, we're making your food really fresh. Yeah, that's it. Bacon, make the food! Was this what you ordered? Oh, we don't even serve popcorn here! What are you doing? Oh, you think that you're the manager or something? No, but I should be. This is ridiculous! Okay, I can't wait till this lady goes away. She seems really grumpy. Okay, where's she park? Oh, wait, there she is. She's still at the order window. What's she doing? Hey, I didn't feel like pulling forward. Oh, okay, well, here's all your meal, and, um, you have a wonderful day. Yay! Thank you. This food better be fresh. It is. Bye! Ugh. Oh, my gosh. I can't believe I have to work here. This is, like, the worst day of my life. Bacon! Get rid of Get with it! You were supposed to make the food! Oh, uh, we have a customer, and you're yelling at the manager. Hi, can I help you? Yeah, this girl is yelling at you. She didn't even give me any napkins. That's <gasps> true. I gave you three napkins. Well, I wanted five. Okay, but you're only one person. How many napkins do you need? Are you the biggest slob in the world? Uh oh Whoa. Um, sorry, lady, but obviously you don't understand how to be a good McDonald's, you know, employee and teammate. You're fired. Wait, what? I got fired from McDonald's? get to take a happy meal home i'm hungry you said i got a free meal on my lunch break no what i want my happy meal oh. Oh. this is the worst day ever ew what's that horrible smell i don't know i think it smells good oh it's just your mom yeah it's just your mom smelling like greasy french fries mm, greasy french fries mom I think you should work there every single day for the rest of your life. Well, that's impossible since I got fired. What? Tummy kind of hurts. Oh, it's only 12.30 at night? Why do I have to go to the bathroom right now? That's so weird. Oh, no. I hope I'm not going to get a stomach ache. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, oh, oh finally. Made it to the party. Oh, I just don't yeah. really feel good. Oh, what's wrong with me? Oh, it was probably nothing. I'll just go back to bed and get a good night's sleep. Five minutes later. Oh no! Not again! Oh. <laughs> yes, I'm definitely sick. Oh. Oh. Is that Daisy's alarm? It's already gone off like three times. Why doesn't she turn that off?
off. That's so annoying. Ugh, she's probably in the shower and forgot about it. I'll just have to go turn it off, I guess, unless I want to hear that all the while I'm sleeping in. Daisy, what are you doing? Why are you still in bed? Uh-oh. Oh, Molly, it was up all night long. Puffing and running into the bathroom and... Oh, God, Daisy, are you sick? I think so, Molly. Does my face look sick? Um, well, you have a green face and pink spots all over. Yes, you're sick! <coughs> Don't give it to me. Ugh, gross. Ew. Oh, thanks, Molly. You're so kind. Well, ew, gross. And how come it smells like stinky doo-doo in here? <coughs> because, Molly, I told you it was up all night long sick. Uh-oh. gross. Well, wait a minute. Does this mean you don't have to go to school today? I can't go to school. How sad. Well, why should I have to go to school and you don't? Because, Molly, look at me. I'm green with pink spots. I'm really sick. Now get out of my room. I don't feel good. Oh, fine. I can't believe my sister gets to stay home and I have to go to school. How is that fair? Hey, wait a minute. <laughs> I have the perfect idea. Oh, isn't she so cute when she's asleep in her crib? Look at her little passy. It's so adorable. Baby Kira, come on, sweetheart. It's time to wake up. Come on, I made breakfast. Wake up, sweetie. Which reminds me, Molly and Daisy aren't out of bed yet. Which I would expect from Molly, but Daisy? Hmm, she must have overslept. Oh, my stomach hurts so bad. Daisy? What's going on, honey? You're not out of bed yet. He won't sick. He definitely sick, mama. I can't have sick, baby Kira. I, I don't feel so good, mom. Oh, you're green. And are those spots all over your face? Oh, my goodness, honey. I don't get out of bed. I am for Daisy feel bad. Oh, baby Kira, I don't think you should be around your sister right now. She might be contagious. Ow. I can't just tell mama, though. Oh, she just wants to help, honey. So, what are your symptoms? Well, I was up all night puking and running to the bathroom. I feel super cold, but my skin feels hot, and I feel nauseous still. Oh, my. That definitely sounds like some sort of flu. You need to stay home from school. I'll call the school. Thanks, Mom. I really don't Aww. want to miss school today. I know. Well, I got the mom, but I can't get temperature. Whoa, that thermometer looks weird. Oh, I brought it home from the hospital. It's a new type of thermometer. It works really well. It's very accurate. Okay, hold still. Baby Kira's going to take your temperature. I just get blood at this. Whoa! Your temperature's 103.2. Wow, you're definitely going to need to take some medicine to bring that down. After I wake up, Molly, I'll bring you some medicine, okay, sweetie? Okay, thanks, Bob. Uh-oh! Here comes Mom! I have to get back in bed. Oh! Oh! I'm so sick! <sighs> Molly, are you okay? No! I'm so sick! Oh, really? Well, what are your symptoms? Um, I farted and it smelled like a taco! What? I've got an upset stomach is what I'm trying to say. Yes, it's terrible! I can't go to school. Absolutely not. I have to stay here and play Roblox all day. Molly, are you faking being sick because your sister is sick? What? No, I didn't even know she was sick. Yes, you did, Molly. You came in here. Molly... Do you want to get grounded? No. Are you really sick? Um, the thought of going to school and having to face my teacher and not having done my homework makes me kind of sick. Uh-oh! Molly, get out of bed. Go down and eat breakfast. I have to bring Daisy some medicine. Ugh, why don't you believe me, Mom? Because, Molly, I think you're just sick because you have to go to school. Not because you're actually sick. Now go get ready. Fine! Ow! I'm coming with the medicine, Daisy! Daisy, Daisy, Daisy. She always gets away with everything. I get a bunch of guys. I get a bunch I nurse baby Kira. Oh, you're nurse baby Kira. Aren't you adorable? Okay. Mom made pancakes, so I guess this makes this day a little bit better, but, you know, not totally. Still have to go to school. My sister gets to stay home. Mm. Oh, look at that extra syrup. 
delicious, so delicious. I can't stop eating it, for real. Mm, I want some more. It's so delicious, I really want some more. <laughs> oh my god, I love when you're playing Roblox, you try to place something on the table and like, it ends up some somewhere weird. <laughs> Look at my plate of pancakes. It's literally like balancing on the edge of that chair. <laughs> Sometimes Roblox glitches are so ridiculous. Ugh, why do I eat so many pancakes? My stomach kind of hurts. <gasps> I hope I didn't catch it. Molly, you didn't catch anything. You just ate too many pancakes. Yeah, but since when have I not been able to eat a ton of pancakes? Like never. I always eat every single pancake in the entire world. Daisy, you're so lucky you get to stay home. I don't think she's very lucky, Molly. Look at her. She looks terrible. I could have found you for you feel bad. Here you go, Daisy. Why am I drinking that from Baby Q a sippy cup, Mom? Um, well, <laughs> I haven't run the dishwasher yet. It's all I had. Besides, remember when you were little? It was the only way you take medicine is in your bottle or your sippy cup. Mom, seriously? Well, it's all I have clean, so just, just drink it, okay? Uh, I I just gotta make sure Molly's getting ready to get on the bus. I'll be right back to check on you. Don't worry, Mama. I know it's baby killer. I take good care of this. Ugh, those pancakes were like too much. Seriously. Oh, I feel like... Uh, uh, well, at least I'm ready for school. I guess that's something. I'm gonna snap my adorable outfit right now because I do look super cute. Look at me. I have on my unicorn sweatshirt. So cute. It has all the colors of the rainbow on it. Just a pair of jeans. And yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna actually give myself this cute. I think I'm gonna give myself <laughs> that's perfect to go with my unicorn. Yes! Sending it to everyone I know. Send to everyone. <laughs> Hello, bouncy bird. We meet again. Ah! Oh no! Ooh. Why can I never ever win at this game? I can never win. I shall beat you, bouncy bird. If it's the last thing I do. Whoa! You can't touch Ooh. like oh whoa, life pay? No, I don't I don't have any money. I just have to start over from the beginning. <laughs> Molly, are you getting ready for school? Uh-huh, yep, sure I am. Um, Molly, are you dressed? Yep, dressed. Oh, this game. Are you playing games on your phone? Um, caught you. Come on, the bus is going to be here any minute. Okay, fine. Don't, don't get back in bed. Sorry, that I didn't mean to. That was a Roblox thing. I swear it. <laughs> Does anyone else out there um, get on the bus before the sun even comes up? Like, how ridiculous is this? We are not supposed to be waking up this early in the morning. Seriously. I I, I think that we should change this about it. I'm like, no more getting on the school bus when it's dark. That's too early. It's way too early. I guess um the sun just comes up as I'm getting on the bus because I'm only the second person that gets picked up in the entire school. Hey, good morning, Molly. Wait, where's Daisy? Okay, everybody. Um, we're going to go pick up the other students. So make sure you stay in your seats. Yeah, I know, Bacon Hair. We hear ya. Oh, if, if, if I could only stop being a noob, I could get a better job than school bus driver. And I could actually, you know, buy some shoes. I mean, why am I such a Bacon Hair? Hey, being a school bus driver is very important work. Yeah, and, until you get homework crumpled up and thrown at your bacon hair. Okay, maybe the students are a little cray-cray with you, bacon, but, you know, overall, this has got to be a great job, right? I don't know. Remember when we all got the stomach bug and we were throwing up all over the bus and then someone threw up in bacon's hair? Yeah, remember that? Oh, yeah, that was pretty terrible. I think I have a Snapchat of that. Let me look at my phone and see. Na -da 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 -da. Oh, no, I think it got erased. That would have been amazing if I still had that. Oh, yeah, it's a memory I want to remember forever, not. Anyway, Molly, where's Daisy? Did she get a ride from your mom or something? No, she's sick with none other than the flu. What? Is she going to be okay? I'm sure she is. I just think it's really unfair that she gets to stay home while I'm at school. Well, in her defense, 
personally, do you really want to be home puking and everything? If it meant I could miss doing homework, yes! Okay, class, I need everyone to um, hand in your homework last night. Did anybody have any questions about it? Homework? Uh, homework? What homework? Molly, you have homework every single night except for the weekend. You knew you had homework. Uh, Molly, did you not do your homework again? <gasps> um, uh... Molly, you know, I'm a really cool teacher and all, but I just have to tell you that, well, I'm giving you detention. Detention? Mr. Snickerbucker, you can't do this! I, I've never had detention in my life. I, I am the most best student in the whole world! This is shocking to me. <laughs> Molly without detention is like me without blue hair. Pfft, you're crazy. Billy, I don't know what you're talking about. Your hair isn't blue. Molly, sit down. But I don't want detention, please! Coming to school today was enough work. Well, you also need to do your homework, and you know this, Molly. Now sit down and take your detention because it's what you're getting. Ow! Detention? Ugh! You know, you could actually do your homework, and then you wouldn't get in trouble. Well, how does that help me now? I've already got the detention. Ooh, my tummy feels kind of weird. Uh, Mr. Schoenbacher, can I go to the bathroom? No, Molly, you need to do your work. I don't really have to go. Please, 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 please. Okay, but hurry back. Okay, I will. Ah! Oh my god, my stomach really hurts. Oh, I'm not gonna make it, I'm not gonna make it. Ah, why was the door open? Oh, okay, I just had to pull the handle. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh! Wait, I didn't even close the door. <laughs> that could have been really bad. Oh, my stomach hurts. Why oh, I ate so many pancakes. I always think I can eat more pancakes than I actually can. Too many! Okay, okay, I think I'm okay now. <sighs> Don't go in that bathroom, though. Woo-wee, it's closed for the rest of the day. Thank you for joining us again, Molly. Uh, you're welcome. I didn't know it was such an amazing thing to have me in your class. It's not. Okay, everybody else has their books out, Molly, except for you. That's because my stomach's kind of really upset. Uh-huh, sure. Don't try to get out of detention. I'm not trying to get out of detention. Please. My tummy really hurts. I'm like, are you okay? Not really, Brookie. My stomach is just really hurting me. Oh, no, Molly. You don't think you caught Daisy's flu, do you? <gasps> I don't know. Oh. Okay, Molly. I want you to go up to the board and read what's on it for me, please. Okay. If you really want me to... Oh, oh, my uh -oh. stomach! Oh. <laughs> oh, Molly, why didn't you go to the bathroom? Because I told you I needed to go and you wouldn't let me. Oh, yuck. Sorry. <laughs> yes. What is a continent? A continent is a very large landmass. Woohoo! Saved by the bell. Everyone is dismissed to lunch. Ugh, lunch. That doesn't sound very good. Hey, kids. What's up? Hey, Large Marge. Whoa, Molly, look. She has your favorites out today. Pizza, cheeseburgers, everything you love. French fries. Ugh, I don't want any of it. What? Wait, what? Are you kidding me right now, Molly? You love this stuff. I'm Snapchatting it. Because this is like the most delicious like lunch we've had in all like the school year, pretty much. I'm choosing a cheeseburger. I don't want to Snapchat lunch. Molly, are you okay? Maybe you did actually get sick. Come on, try something. Okay. Ugh. Nah, I'm just going to put my tray back. Ugh. Oh, did you have the hiccups, Molly? <gasps> yeah. And, and, uh-oh. I gotta go to the bathroom again. Molly, are you okay? Oh my gosh, I think Molly might be sick. Oh, why are the bathrooms so far away? Oh. Oh no, oh no, oh no! Um, I have to clean the bathrooms! Oh no! Huh. Why does a janitor have to come in right when I'm in the bathroom? Uh, somebody's in here! Okay, well the bathroom's gonna be closed in two minutes because I have to actually clean it. Ooh. No, it can't be closed! Molly, are you in there? Prookie! Oh no! Molly, are you okay? Oh, ew! There's a bunch of pink on your face. And why does it look like a rainbow? Oh, I ate some Skittles on the school bus. Whoopsie. 
Ugh, Molly, gross. Okay, girls, I need you to get out of here because, ew, it really needs to get cleaned. I'm sorry, but um, I think I might have the stomach bug and... Oh, great. No, I'm going to catch uh -oh. the stomach bug. Wait a minute. Aren't you the school bus driver? Yeah, but I wanted to be able to get a pair of shoes, so bacon hair has to have two jobs, okay? And now also the third job is going to be uh, canceled because I'm going to catch the stomach bug from you. Wow, Bacon, you really do have a rough life. Only, I think you need to go to the school nurse. Stat! Ugh. Oh, can't make it! Blech. Yeah, Molly, I'm walking you to the school nurse right now. Come on. Ugh. Thanks for being such a good friend, Brookie. Molly, I really hope you feel better. Also, don't give me the flu. I'm trying not to, Brookie. I'm trying not to. Well, hopefully the nurse will just call your mom and you can go home. Uh, and also, you still look like you're puking. Uh, uh. Oh, hello there. Um, checking into the nurse's office? Yeah. Oh, you look terrible. Ew. Why do you have rainbow puke? I ate Skittles on the school bus on the way to school. Oh, my. Okay, let's take your temperature. Go ahead, lay on the nurse's cot. The magic nurse's cot. Everybody knows. This will make you feel better. If anything will make you feel better... Magic nurse cat will. That's right. Sometimes all you need to do is just lay down for a few minutes and then you'll feel better. I have to Snapchat this. This is kind of crazy. You need to lay down. I know, but first I want to show everybody that I was throwing up. Look, I'm going to be like a dog throwing up. <laughs> yeah. Don't I look adorable? Not. Um, this is more like it. Yeah, that's exactly what I'm going to do. <laughs> OMG. I'm sending it to everybody I know. I put on a face mask, Molly, obviously, because you're sick. Could you lay down, please? I'm, I'm trying to lay down, but this game won't let me, and I'm really sick, and I need to lay down. Come on, Roblox, what's wrong with you? Okay, there you go. Thank you for laying down. Okay, just hold still. I'm going to take your temperature. Oh, wow. Over 100. And I suspect it's going to keep climbing since you are throwing up. Yeah, I don't feel so good. I'm going to call your mom. Can I go home? Yes, she'll have to come pick you up. It's ringing, Molly. Ugh, thank goodness. I can't wait to go home. Hello? Oh, hi. Is this Laura Acker? Yes, it is. Oh, no. Don't tell me Molly got suspended. <gasps> what? No. She's in the nurse's office. She's not feeling well. Ugh. She's always trying to get away with that. She's just faking it. No, Mrs. Acker. I actually took her temperature and she's throwing up. She's actually really sick. Wait, what? Okay, tell Molly I'll be there in 15 minutes to pick her up. All right, I will. Thank you. Well, your mom thought you were faking it. Do you often pretend that you're sick? Only when I don't want to go to school, do my homework, or be responsible for anything. Okay, so a lot. You might want to stop doing that. She didn't quite believe that you were sick. So wait, she's not coming to get me? I'm stuck on the nurse's magic cot when I want to go home and get in my pajamas and eat popsicles. No, honey, she's coming to pick you up. You just rest, and when she gets here, she can come get you. Thank you. Oh, I feel so sick, Mom. <gasps> Daisy, I'm so sorry, but I have to run over to the school. What? No, you can't leave me. I need more popsicles, and I need you to tell me. Oh, there, there, are you okay? Oh, honey, as much as I'd love to stay here and baby you while you're sick, I have to run over to this pick up this over to the school and pick up your sister because she's also sick. She's faking it. She's not even sick. Actually, the school nurse called and she caught your stomach bug too, or whatever this is. I don't have it. That's right. Hopefully you don't get it, baby Kira. It's terrible. You don't want it. I feel bad for Molly. Yeah, me too. Okay, I'm going to run over there with baby Kira. I'll be back in like 15 minutes, okay? Okay, mama, I'll text you if I need anything. Okay, honey, I'll be right back. Oh, no, money's got the bug too. Mama, I like it. Coco, mom, went on your phone. Of course, you can watch it on my phone, honey. Oh, but I think you should stay away from Molly and Daisy. I love them. I like to stay away from them. I know, honey, but the truth of the matter is they both are sick and I don't want you to catch it. Mama, I make a Snapchat. Oh, that's so cute, honey. But listen to what I'm saying. No catching what your sisters have. 
I have all my marble. Where's my mom? I need to go home. Molly? Oh my goodness, Molly, you look so sick. Get in, honey. Mom, I'm sorry, but I'm not faking it this time. I'm not, sweetheart. But maybe you should stop faking things so much in the future so you're believed. Yeah, you're probably right, but ugh. My stomach is so upset. I threw up at school, and it was like rainbows from the skulls I ate on the school bus. Ew. And aww. Oh, and also, ew. Okay, Mom's gonna run in and just get some chicken noodle soup and some other supplies, okay? Hang tight. Okay, Mom. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I think I'm gonna throw up right here. Yep. I'm gonna. Blech. Ew, this is terrible. I feel like some sort of monster on Halloween. Oh, worst day ever. I forget autumn. I got on Snapchat. Take a look. I'm back, girls. Are you okay, Molly? No, she flew up everywhere. I sent a snap of it to everyone. You did not, did you, baby Kira? Ah, uh, yeah, I did. OMG! Oh, baby Kira! Oh my gosh, you caught it barfing! Oh, that is so embarrassing. Mom, why'd you let her use your phone? Um, sorry. Oh, my life as I know it is over. Oh, Molly, this will blow over, I promise. Okay, let's go home and get you tucked into bed. I thought it was funny. Yeah, real funny. Uh-oh, I might have to have you pull over, Mom. Seriously, we're almost home. I know, but I'm going to throw up again, I think. Oh, no, Molly. All right, I'll take a shortcut. Okay, we're here. I got to run to the bathroom. Oh, this has been the worst stomach bug of my entire life. Oh, 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 wait, where's the bathroom? I can't even remember. Okay, there we go. Oh, Oh. What? What happened to the toilet? Uh -oh. Okay. Someone took the toilet out of our bathroom. Sorry, Molly, it wasn't working. So the repairman came today to take it back to his shop and fix it. Oh, who does that? Who steals a toilet? That's like something the Grinch would do. What am I gonna do without a toilet? Use a different bathroom. Oh. I Snapchat that, Molly. What? What? Yeah, you were talking about how there was no toilet. It was funny. Ah, oh, give me that phone. I'm going to smash it. Get away. Get mom phone. Give me that phone. I don't want people to see me like this. It's embarrassing. I'm going to smash it. I'm going to smash that phone. And Snapchat with it. Molly, that's my phone. And it's a brand new iPhone. I haven't even paid for it yet. Well, tell baby Gary to stop Snapchatting everything. Because it's embarrassing. Yeah. I'll tell her. You go up and get in bed. Obviously, you're very sick. Okay. <laughs> Molly? Molly? Do you want to just get in here with me since we're both sick? Yeah. Oh, I feel terrible. At least you didn't get the pink spots. Yeah, I guess that's one good thing. <laughs> No, not quite. Molly, do you feel better? I feel so much better. Yeah, I feel like all better. Thank goodness, that stomach bug was terrible. I know, right? Thank goodness it's over. I can't believe I'm about to say this, but I'm actually like thinking like, wow, I would rather go to school than have that stomach bug. Ugh, I even slept in my clothes last night because I was too tired to even get in my pajamas. <coughs> Is that baby Kira crying? She sure sounds like it, Molly. I wonder if Mom's taking care of her. I'm gonna go check. I can't get for you, get for you. Baby Kira? Baby Kira? Oh my gosh, Baby Kira, are you okay? I feel good. Yeah, do you feel Oh my gosh. Um, let me see what is considered a fever that I should take you to the emergency room if you're a baby. All right, I better get my thermometer. Oh my gosh. This is definitely a fever you need to go to the hospital for. 102? Baby Kira, wake up. Baby Kira, 
Oh my gosh, she's not waking up. Bully, Daisy, someone call 911. What did Bob just say? I think she said baby Kira is having trouble waking up. She's really sick, Daisy. I, I need to call 911. Call them really quick, Molly, do it. 911, what's your emergency? Hi, I need an ambulance in my house. My baby sister, she's not really responding and she's sick with the bug or something. I don't know. We'll send an ambulance out immediately. Okay, thank you. She's in here. She's in here. Okay, ma'am. I'm going to do my best to take good care of your baby. Baby Kira, can you hear me? I told you I feel good. Oh, she's responding. Thank goodness. I was so worried. Excuse me, ma'am. You're going to have to leave. What time? Her mother. I'm not leaving. Well, you keep running into me, and I can't do my job if you're, well, in the way. I, I, okay, fine. I'll wait outside the door, but take good care of my baby. Don't worry. I'm going to. Okay, baby Kira. I'm going to um, listen to your heart, and I'm then I'm going to put you in the ambulance, and we're going to go to the emergency room. But don't worry. When this is all over, you can have a delicious lollipop. Yeah, baby Kira, everything's going to be fine. Doesn't this thing go any faster? Nope, this is as fast as it goes. But don't worry, I'm going to get your baby there just as soon as possible. I'm just so worried. Yes, this one goes faster. Pull over and let me drive. Okay, fine. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You forgot to hit the brake. You're a terrible driver for a paramedic. Hey, I just take care of people. I didn't say that I was a good driver. Well, I'm an awesome driver and we're getting my baby there quicker because she's really sick. Everything's gonna be okay, sweetheart. I promise. No, we're driving. You're an idiot. What? No, I'm not. I'm a good driver. I've never even gotten a ticket. Buddy, are you okay? No. This is all our fault. What? <gasps> Why is it our fault? Because we brought this flu home, and now baby Kira is so sick because she's a baby, and it's it's really my fault. Molly, the flu is just a bug. I mean, anybody can get the germs. We wash our hands, we do our best, but she still caught it. The stomach flu is very, very contagious. <sighs> I just wish I had known I was coming to the hospital. I actually would have worn some shoes. Oh, I'm just so worried about baby Kira. Oh, my poor baby. I hope that you're okay. I really hope that you're okay. Hey everybody, it's Dr. Miley, and I'm so smiley because today is my first day at my new hospital. I'm so excited to take care of so many adorable kids as your favorite doctor, Dr. Smiley Miley. <laughs> oh, look, I'm gonna dress up as a little dog, cute. Aww. All right, time to go see my first patient. Bye everybody. What patient do I have first? Let's go see. Oh, what's going on here? Can you tell me your daughter's symptoms? Yes, my other two daughters who are older had what seemed to be the stomach bug. And now my baby has whatever they have, I think. Oh, well, we should run some tests and find out. Would you mind if I shared this on my TikTok? What? Yes? Oh, sorry, some of my patients actually let me um, just share their case on my Instagram and on my TikTok because I'm kind of a famous doctor here in the Children's Hospital. Have you heard of me? Smiley Miley. Wait, what? You're Smiley Miley? Oh my God. Did you hear that, baby Kara? We're going to be famous. But first of all, let's get your baby girl feeling so much better. Okay, sweetheart, I know you don't feel good, but I just need you to lay completely still while I do this x-ray of your chest and your tummy. I just wanna make sure that nothing else is going on, okay? Okay, the machine, let me just take, make sure it's in the right position. Okay, perfect. Beep, boop, boop, beep, boop, boop, beep, boop, boop, beep, boop, beep, boop. I look at that boy, you up here. Oh no, the machine doesn't actually make that sound. I just do for fun. Beep, boop, boop, beep, boop, boop. Shouldn't it make that sound though? I mean, <laughs> I mean, it's so quiet, it's weird. Beep, boop, beep, beep, boop, beep. Okay, we're done. Let's take a look at your x-ray. 
Oh, wow. Yeah, you definitely have a sad, frowny face type of x-ray. Because you have an infection. You definitely need some medicine. Come on, sweetie. Let's go back and see your mom. I'll have you feeling better in no time. For that matter, I think you can probably just spend the night for one night and then go straight home to rest in your own crib. Baby Kira, I was so worried. Is everything gonna be okay? I took a x-ray of her chest and tummy and it does look like she has um, an infection. So I'm gonna give her some medicine and keep her for observation overnight, okay? Okay, but she'll be okay? Yeah, she's a great and healthy little girl. She should be fine once this medicine gets in her system. Thank you, Dr. Smiley Miley. You're amazing. You're welcome. Here I am with my amazing little patient, baby Kira. Where are you, baby Kira? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Anyway, guys. Oh, she's kind of being shy. Oh, wait, there she is. Yeah, she's adorable. And guys, today I'm going to make baby Kira feel all better. So make sure you log in to all of my social media channels to see how I do it. Bye. So we just got home from the hospital, everybody. Uh, my sister, baby Kira, is feeling so much better. She's just coming into the house now. And she got medicine, so she's she's feeling much better. And my sister and I are all feeling better. Everyone's healthy. That's right, girls. Oh, I've had the most worrisome week ever. But at least we get to go back to school. What? Back to school already? Yeah, Molly, everybody's healthy. You get to go back to school. Oh, oh wait, um, Brookie's calling me, guys. I gotta end this snap. Whoa, she tried calling me like five times. <sighs> Hello? Hey, Molly. Ugh. I am so sick. What? Oh no, you caught it. Yeah, did it feel like your stomach was trying to crawl outside of your body? Yep. Did it feel like you had to run to the bathroom every five seconds? Yep. Did it feel like you were dying? Yes, it totally did. Oh no, Bookie, I'm so sorry. We won't see you at school. Oh, this is terrible. Sorry. Uh, if we give it to you, I'm really sorry, Brookie. Girls, um, you have to say goodbye right now. There's something important on the news. Okay, Mom. Um, I gotta go, Brookie. I'll call you later to check on you. Bye, Molly. Bye. Feel better. Next up, we talk about a woman goes missing for years. But first, Brooke, this is crazy. All of our town is shut down for a week. Wait, what? What are you talking about? Oh, it's true. The entire town has got the stomach on. Oh my god. Do you think our toilets can handle that? Let me answer that. Probably not. School is closed for the rest of the week. Everybody, please stay home. Stay inside. Just DoorDash so that no one has to see the, anyone else. And we can just stop the spread of this crazy stomach bug virus. Molly, we seriously infected the entire town. Ow! Um, oopsie! <laughs> You're not gonna say goodbye to Bob. Bye, Mom. Can't believe you're making us go to school again. Ugh, when's the bus gonna get here? It's kind of cold out and it's still dark. That's because we catch the bus so early in the morning, Molly. Why are you so grumpy? Cause I have to go to school. I don't want to. Well, here's the school bus, Molly. No excuse not to get to school. Ugh. Hey, Brookie. Hey, Molly. Whoa, you look super grumpy. Did you wake up on the wrong side of the bed today? No, she just doesn't want to be at school. She just wanted to stay home and play Roblox all day. Ooh. Yeah, I did. And, and look where I am. School. All good. How many days of my life am I going to be at school? Pretty much all of them, Molly. Hmm, <laughs> this Starbucks is delicious. What? I didn't even have time to finish my Starbucks. Oh, school is so annoying. Wow, you actually look grumpier than I do, Molly. And I'm pretty grumpy because I didn't get to finish my Starbucks and the teacher won't let us drink it in class. Molly, you love art class. 
Yeah, I guess I can turn my frown upside down. So, Daisy's not taking art class anymore? Nah, she's doing the gifted program. It's a science thing that she does every first period, every Monday and Wednesday. Wow, she's so smart. Whatever, I think she's a total nerd. <gasps> well, yeah, maybe she is, but being a nerd's not a bad thing. She's gonna have, like, the most amazing job someday. And and you won't, Sarah, so take that, ha, ha, ha. Whoa, Molly, you definitely did wake up on the wrong side of the bed. Yeah, well, I just don't want to deal with bullying today. Okay, Sarah? Whatever. Good morning, class. Good morning, Mrs. A. Oh, you look so cute today. Thank you. I just tried to look as artsy as possible since I am, well, the art teacher. <laughs> Mrs. A, you're so cool. Whatever, I'm getting on Snapchat. Sarah, unless you're making art with Snapchat, then I suggest you put down your phone, silly. Mrs. A, you are so nice. Okay, I don't know what my masterpiece is going to be today, but I'm thinking that I might um actually paint a picture of my dog, Gracie, because it's almost her birthday, and she's just the most adorable dog. <coughs> oh, yeah, I've seen pictures of her on your Snapchat. She is super cute. That would be a great painting to make, Molly. Let me know if you need any help with that. You know where the supplies are. Sure do. <laughs> Sarah, what are you drawing? I'm drawing you not being next to me and me being completely alone in this classroom. Wait, what? Meaning you're annoying. Leave me alone. Oh, okay, fine. Cheapers, she's still in full-on bully mode. I'm looking for motivation in on my phone because, I don't know, I've been on Pinterest looking at different things I want to do for my art project, but I don't know what I'm going to do. Don't worry, Brookie. You'll figure out something. Wow, Molly, that's amazing work. You should be very proud of yourself. <laughs> um, but you are wearing a lot of the paint. <laughs> yeah, I know. Oopsie, I'm a really messy painter. May I have your attention? May I have your attention? Will Mrs. A please report to the principal's office? Miss A, please report to the principal's office. Uh-oh, Miss A, you're in trouble. Getting called to the principal's office. Um, I'm a teacher. I can't get detention. Wait, what? That's not fair. What if you were bad and didn't do your homework? <laughs> Molly, you're being so ridiculous right now. She ha doesn't have homework. Actually, I have a lot of homework. I grade papers and do lots of schoolwork at home. Really? Remind me never to become a teacher. That sounds like a lot of hard work. Be right back, class. Keep working on your art. Oh, hi, Principal Bippity Boop Boop. <laughs> what? No, 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 that's not how you say it. It's, uh, oh, never mind. Call me Mr. B. Sorry, your name is really hard to pronounce. And is it me or you just keep getting shorter? What? I'm not short. Why you call me short? Oh, sorry. Didn't mean to point that out. <laughs> Don't give me detention. Can you give me detention? I'm a grown-up, you know. No, I'm not going to give you detention. But we need to have a serious talk, Mrs. A. Um, okay. But it's hard to take you serious when you're, well... That short and not wearing shoes! <laughs> you look like you're in daycare. Oh, sorry. But where are your shoes? What? Oh! I forgot my shoes at home again! Ugh. It's okay, Principal B. B, 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 B. <laughs> Call me Mr. B! You obviously can't pronounce my name. Sorry. Principal B, Um, what is it I can do for you? The serious talk is this. You're not serious enough. What? I'm the art teacher. I'm supposed to have fun with the kids. Help them inspire creativity and... Yeah, blah, 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 blah. And also a lot of... Blah! <gasps> Whoa! Mr. B, Principal B, whatever you want to be called. Uh, you seem very grumpy today. Do you need like a little snack? Maybe you're just hungry. What? No, I ate a good breakfast. I just forgot my shoes. But anyway, I I'm fine. I just don't like how well nice you are. Um, okay. If you can't be more strict, you're fired. But I just bought a house and the bills are going to be due. You can't fire me. It's the only school in town. I won't have a job. I'll be homeless. Then I suggest getting stricter. Uh -oh. Now get out of my office. Okay. Well, good talk, Principal Bippity Boop 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 Boop. You can call me Principal B! Ugh! 
Uh, Bricky, I had a little bit of an accident with the paint. Molly, you you look like you hit your head and got hurt or something. Is that blood or paint? Um, it's definitely paint. Uh, I just really get into my artwork and, um, well, uh, I might be the messiest painter in the world. Yeah, I'm thinking so, Molly. <laughs> you might need to go to the bathroom and wash your face. Hey, look, Mrs. A! Had a little bit of a painting accident. What? You're gonna make a mess of everything. Wait, what? I thought you thought it was cute and funny that I was such a messy painter. Canvas, what are you even doing? Just wasting time this entire time? No, I'm just not very good at art. And I just figured out what exactly I wanted to do. And I'm sorry. Ugh, you two are gonna definitely fail this class. You for being messy, and you for being lazy. Uh -oh. Um, Brookie is not lazy. She wakes up every morning and goes for like a five mile run. She's just not that good at art. No offense, Brookie. None taken, Molly. Well, I don't think. Mrs. A, can I wash the paint off my face? What? Whoa! Looks like I'm not the only one that got paint on my face. What happened to you? What are you talking about? I like this look. Yeah. Um, okay, as long as you like it. Uh, can I go to the bathroom? I need to wash this paint off. It's getting into my eyes. Oh, it's stinging. Yes, you have exactly 30 seconds. If you're late, detention. Whoa, um, clock starts now. Okay, okay. Oh God, oh God. I got 30 seconds or I'm gonna get detention. What happened to Mrs. A? She used to be so cool. Perfect, totally within the 30 seconds. Uh-oh, now I have to go potty. Okay, I just gotta be quick about it. That's all, as long as I'm super fast and back in like, um, 10 seconds? Everything should be fine. Yeah, fine. La 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 la, just trying to hurry. Why was the toilet lid open? Oh god, this toilet must be broken. All right, I gotta go use the other one. No, 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 no. Oh god, I have like five seconds left. Rout row! Ugh, why'd I eat so many pancakes for breakfast? I mean, they were delicious, but. Uh, okay, gotta get back to class. Uh oh, the door won't open. Ah, let me out of the bathroom! Okay, maybe I can jump over the top. Don't panic, Molly. Um, you ever think when you're in the bathroom at school, if the door, like, locked and you couldn't get out, could you squeeze under the door or not? I'm about to find out. Uh, uh, oh, my God, I'm getting stuck. Oh, oh my God, I can't fit underneath there. I'm too fat to get under the door. Okay, maybe this way. Um, I'm stuck inside the bathroom. <laughs> OMG, I'm too fat to get under the door. Um, I don't know what to do right now. Maybe scream for the janitor? Come on, you stupid lock! Open! Oh, wait, the door just opened. Yay! <laughs> Uh-oh, I'm a little bit late, but she's got to understand. I got trapped in the bathroom. There you are. Where have you been? Well, I washed the paint off my face, as you can see. Um, But then I had to go to the bathroom because I ate a lot of pancakes this morning. I don't like your excuses. This is A. You used to be so cool. What happened to you? What happened is that I'm stripped. Um, yeah, I noticed. Um, anyway, I got locked in the bathroom. I tried to crawl underneath the stall, but I was a little too chubby from all the pancakes I ate and I couldn't fit. And then I opened the door and I came back as soon as I opened it. A likely story. So you couldn't open the door and then magically it opened? Detention. But you just said I did a really great job on my painting. I really did get stuck in the bathroom. I don't think I deserve detention. I, I did good in class and I had to go to the bathroom. I'm sorry. I don't care what you want or what you say. Detention! Aww. Uh, Mrs. A, no offense or anything, but I don't think you're like you are normally. And I just want to stick up for my best friend because, well, she worked really hard on her painting and she's been doing really good in your class. I don't think she de deserves detention. Well, thank you, Miss Nosy. Now you can sit in detention with her. Wait, <gasps> what? Yep. See you both after class today at 3 p.m. Thanks, Brookie. Sorry, you got detention too. Hey guys, it's me, Molly, and to my BFF, Brookie. Hey guys. And we're making this Snapchat because something is going on with our art teacher, Mrs. A. She's normally so sweet and so nice, just really understanding. And today she's like weird and strict. Yeah. Her face has even changed. Yeah, she's just like dressing different. Her face looks different. It's like she's not even the same person. She's just like being so mean. Anyway, because I took an extra 30 seconds in the bathroom, 
She gave me detention, and I don't, I don't know. I think Brookie and I should try to escape. What? Are you serious, Molly? Totally. Guys, we're making this video so you guys have evidence that our amazing teacher has turned weird and strict. Well, Molly, come on. We better get to detention. Wait, it's in math class? Are you serious? Ugh, this just figures. Welcome to detention. No talking, no smiling, no breathing. Um, excuse me, breathing is kind of a necessity. Do it quietly. Well, I didn't plan on breathing like this. <gasps> <gasps> Molly, don't make me laugh. You're going to give me extra detention. Did you notice you two are the only ones in here? That's because you're losers. Bruh. Whoa. Maybe you need detention. You're being really rude. Really? Maybe you need in-school suspension. Really? Well... <gasps> <gasps> Molly, stop breathing so loud. I'm not sorry. Well, well, well. Seems I've met my match for being weird. Yeah, I am weird and proud of it. But you didn't meet your match for being strict. That's just you, crazy teacher. Now, come on. I want to tell the principal on you. I cannot believe a student is taking me to the principal. Well, weird strict teacher, I think you deserve it. Oh. What's that, your stomach? Are you not eating lunch? Is that why you're so grumpy? Oh. Wait, is that Principal Bippity Boop Boop? Principal Bippity Boop Boop! What happened to you? Wait, is he just taking a nap or is he dead? What happened? What do you mean, what happened? You were taking a nap behind your desk, obviously. I mean, don't deny it. I do that stuff, too, at school. But, I mean, come on. You're the principal, man. You're supposed to set a good example. No, I wasn't taking a nap. A likely excuse. No, I really wasn't. Some guy in, in a cloak came in with... Uh, had a, he had a black hood over his head, and he, he said that he was taking my job as principal. Then he cocked me over the head with a hammer. What? Wait a minute. I, I saw this principal before. And he told me I had to be weird or strict. And I or I'd lose my job. Sorry, I don't mean to keep sitting at your desk like I'm the principal. But this game, it always makes you sit down. Why? Why? Well, maybe it wants you to be the principal. Apparently, I'm not very good at it. Well, you were taking a nap behind your desk. I was not. I got conked on the head by a hammer. Whoa. I can't believe that happened to you, Principal Bibbidi Boop Boop Boop. Oh, just call me Principal B. <laughs> Look at me. It looks like I'm taking notes. Silly game. <laughs> I can't believe this. I, I I've been weird and strict with my students because that evil principal said that if I wasn't, I'd lose my job. Wait, what? You're not really weird and evil? And strict? No. I never wanted to be that. I just felt like if I wasn't, I'd be homeless with no job. This is terrible. Someone is out there turning teachers into weird, strict teachers. Yeah, we need to get to the bottom of this. But, um, Mrs. A, you can go back to being yourself now. I hope that I can. I mean, I feel sort of stuck as weird and strict. Snap out of it, lady! I don't like you weird and strict. It's, well, weird and strict, and it really stinks. <laughs> oh, I'm back to myself. Mrs. A! Oh, thank goodness. Time to make a Snapchat. Wait, what? That's what you really want to do right now? Yeah, I have to tell everybody. Guys, everybody that goes to school with me, this is the real principal. Principal, principal, bippity boppity boobity doot. Yeah, or something like that. Or maybe it's toot toot. Toot toot. Yeah, principal toot toot. That's it. What? No, I'm not a toot toot. I don't toot toot. Uh-huh, sure you don't. Especially after you have those bean burritos they give us at lunch. Uh-huh. Anyway, guys, he was knocked out by an evil, weird, strict principal guy. And then he made my teacher, Mrs. A, be weird and strict, too. But she's back to normal, and so isn't Principal Toot Toot. It's not Principal Toot Toot! Uh-huh, sure it isn't. Anyway, be careful, guys. This weird, strict principal might be coming to your school. Watch out for him. Seriously. Watch out. All right, I sent it to everybody in the school, and I told everybody on YouTube. Well, Molly, 
That's good. I'm glad to be back to being myself. Me too. You was weird and strict was terrible. Do I still have detention? Nah. You can go home. And great job on your artwork today. Thanks, Mrs. A. Whew. Thank goodness I got rid of the weird strict teacher. Good thing she didn't catch me. Wait, what? I'm confused right now. I thought you were back to nice, Mrs. A. No. I like being weird, strict teacher. <laughs> and now I'm going to go to the next school, get a teaching job in another town, and be weird and strict there, too! <laughs> Wait, what? No, you can't! I'll call the next school. I'll tell them! <laughs> That's what you think. <laughs> Never know what happened to you. <laughs> <laughs>
Molly, I hope you practice considering you're the lead singer. <gasps> yeah, Molly, don't let us down. Like, you're the in charge of the entire school band. Uh, no pressure or anything. I practiced my part, even though I'm so ready for spring break. Of course you did, Daisy. All right, guys, let's get started. No homework? <laughs> well, uh, yeah, exactly. Why don't you go to the principal's office? You've let down the entire band by not practicing. If you continue to not do your homework, you're going to fail this class and probably all of them. Uh, no, I don't need to go to the principal. Uh, let me try it again. Let me give you some advice if you meet this weird guy. Holy guacamole, she's terrible. Ow. Okay, Daisy, okay. No need to say anything rude. We'll just have Molly go because she did not do her homework and she knows three no homeworks in a row means going to the principal's office. No, I'm sick of Molly just making our band sound terrible. This school talent show is important to our class. Molly, you stink. No. Oh, Daisy, this breaks my heart to say this, but you know our no mean words policy here okay, it's number five on our policy paper you had it text to you emailed to you printed out to you at the beginning of the year no mean words towards other students you have to go to the principal what i don't go to the principal no 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 unless they're having me come in there for like an award or something well today you're going for a totally different reason sorry daisy what yeah He's supposed to be strict. He has to make sure all the students behave and everybody gets along. Oh boy, this isn't gonna be good. I can feel it in my bones. Come on, Daisy, don't be afraid. Well, 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 who do we have here? Oh, it's Molly, again. And who is this? Uh, yeah, I was in here last year for the gifted program. Uh, you gave me that award, remember? Yeah, it's my sister. She's in big trouble for being mean. <gasps> what? Mean? Okay, that's it. I have to do it. I'm calling your parents. What? No, that's a little harsh. That's a little strict, don't you think? Yeah, our parents don't need to know about this. I'm afraid they do. I will begin calling your parents now. What? See, I told you. Who says that? I will begin calling your parents now. I mean, who doesn't just call them? He's so weird and strict. Yeah, he's about to call mom and dad. Hi. Hello, who is this? Hello, this is the principal. I just called you. Uh, yeah, she realizes that you're on the phone with her. He's so weird and strict. You are and your husband are going to need to come down to the school immediately. Why, are my girls okay? Is everything all right? Well, yes, they're not hurt. But they are being troublemakers. Uh -oh. Please come to the school right away and bring your husband. Um, okay. Wait, is it just Molly or also Daisy? Both of your daughters. Wait, Daisy? Daisy got in trouble? Well, I guess they believe I could get in trouble, Daisy, but not you. Of course they do. Also, your daughter is wearing an anti-homework shirt. You're not allowed at school. Oh, I didn't see her go out of the house with that. I'm so sorry. Okay, um, I'll be right there with my husband. Thank you. Okay, girls, you can go ahead and just stand over there. I'll just sit here. This is going to be a little bit of a wait. I'm going to stand here nervously. I've got butterflies in my stomach. Uh, my stomach, uh -oh. it hurts so bad. 
can't believe our girls dragged us out of out of work for this. I can't believe Daisy got in trouble. I mean, I expect that from Molly. She's in detention a lot, but Daisy? You may leave. I want to talk to your parents alone. Oh, is it just me or is he getting weird and strict by the moment? Something's not right about our principal. That's for sure. I'm putting this on Snapchat. Okay. You are now in my house with my rules. Uh, I thought we were at the school. Yeah, I thought we were at the school. No, the school is my domain. <laughs> and your daughters need discipline. Discipline? Who is this guy? Oh yeah, yeah. Molly, where'd you go? Molly! She's probably hiding in the bathroom. That's always where she hides when she's about to get in trouble. Today, Molly wore an anti-homework shirt to school. What? I, I didn't know. I'm sorry. Um, don't worry. I'm a police officer, so my daughter will behave because, you know, we, we run a pretty tight ship at my house. We're pretty strict. Well, honey, not that strict. You need to get stricter. A lot stricter. <gasps> Daisy, what are you doing? Well, Molly, I was Snapchatting because the principal is just seeming kind of weirdo and strictle and crazy. Where have you been? I had to go to the bathroom. <laughs> I can't see the of having mom and dad coming down to the school and hearing how naughty I am every day. Um, just made my tummy a little upset. Yeah, exactly. Mine too. Oh, it looks like mom and dad are coming out of the meeting. Hopefully we don't get grounded for life. Dad! Oh, it's so good to see you! Uh, what are you doing here during the day? You know exactly why I'm here. Girls, go get in the car. Uh-oh! Oh, is it just me or does mom and dad look kind of well? Do we look stricter? Because we're about to be. Uh-oh! Molly, Daisy, go inside. You're going to have lots of chores to do. Let's get strict! <laughs> school early. This is not so bad. What are you doing? Um, sitting down, waiting for instructions, of course. You look it up and you start on a giant list of chores. Uh oh Starting with a whole new wardrobe. What? No, I like my no homework shirt. Not allowed at school. Your mother has put out some new outfits for you upstairs. <laughs> Go and get changed, right? Um, anything else notice my parents are getting kind of weird and strict? I think we need to Snapchat this. Uh, everybody, look at my parents. They're being weird and strict. No both. Uh, okay. I'll go up and change. I hope it's a really cute outfit. I'm a cute My mom couldn't possibly mean this shirt or these clothes that she left out for me. Th there's no way. What? What am I wearing? Well, you wanted to wear something weird, so I decided to give you something weird. Mom, I'm not wearing this out of the house. I look ridiculous. What? You're not a Weird Al fan? Uh, well, yeah, but, you know, having a close-up of his face is a little crazy. Well, I think it's awesome. Mom, no, please. Fine. I picked out some other things I think you'll really like. Try them on. Ugh. My mom really has gone weird. I don't really know what's going on with my mom right now. But ever since she met with the principal, some crazy things have been happening. And she's decided that she's going to change my outfits. She just thinks that, like, they're not right or something for school. And, oh, look at that one. I made that myself. I can tell because it's weird. What? Did you just call my shirt weird? shoe fits wear it princess <gasps> i can't believe it i spent so long making that mom we've been home for like five minutes it looks like you cut it out of some construction paper or that you printed it off on the printer and like badly cut it out yeah. i think it's adorable you know what since you don't appreciate my things that i do for you i have the perfect uh, uh no i think i'll pass pass you don't get a choice i'm the mom Put it on. Oh no! The meowing cats weren't bad, and the weird owl wasn't bad. This one is going to be bad! I just know it! Oh my god, my mom has dressed me like a noob! 
says my oof on my shirt. I don't like this one. I'm not wearing Ooh. it. You will wear it because I said so. Now, time to do some chores. Oh, I don't like chores. Well, you like them now. Um, okay. Ow. I promise I never get to go to the principal level again. I have be good. No, too late for that. Now mow the lawn. Uh, we don't have any grass. What time am I supposed to mow? Find some grass and mow it. Um, okay, I'll mow the grass. Holy quackaboli. These kids are such brats. That's so weird. There's a doghouse in our backyard. We don't even have a dog. <coughs> Meanwhile, I'm outside mowing bricks. Tell me you're just standing around not doing any chores. What chores? I see the Daisy's mowing the patio for some reason, and I think you guys are just making up chores that don't even exist. <gasps> oh, really? I want you to serve some dog food for the dogs. Mom, we don't own any dogs. Do what I say. Okay, fine. Dog food. We don't even have dogs. Guys, I don't know what's going on with my parents. They're being insane. And they just, like, my dad just had Daisy mow the grass, but there is no grass. And my mom is telling me to get dog food served for our dogs. Except for, we don't even own dogs. I don't know what she's talking about. Well, surprisingly, we actually had dog food. So, I guess I'll go out back and feed the dogs. How you doing mowing that non-existent grass? Oh, it's a lot of work, Molly, but, you know, I'm handling it. What do you got dog food for? I'm going to feed our dogs. Molly, we don't have a dog, but all of a sudden there's a dog, a dog house in our backyard. I don't even understand. I don't either. Where's these dogs I'm supposed to be feeding? There you are. Come in here, girls. Um, I didn't feed the dogs yet because I didn't know where to feed them. Set that down on the table, please. Um, okay. Do the, do the dogs eat at the table? They sure do. Molly, our parents have gone all weird and strict. Shh, here comes Mom. Oh, perfect. You set it on the table. Now go ahead and sit down and eat. Wait, what? I thought this was for the dogs. Uh-oh. Oh, you girls are going to have dog food surprise for dinner. What? Nah, that's where I draw the line. Oh, really? Sounds like these girls need to be grounded for life. Agreed. No dinner for either of you. I uh, know, I'm really hungry. I'll take the dog food surprise. Nope. To bed. What? Ugh. What is wrong with my parents? They've gone crazy. I didn't even get to eat my dog food snack. Now I'm feeling really sad. This is all your fault, Molly. You're the one that, 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 that got us in trouble in the first place. Well, I didn't break the rule in school. That would be all you. Oh, yeah, yeah, Molly. What are we going to do? First of all, we're going to Snapchat about this in case someone um, needs to see this. Like, they'll see it, and then maybe they'll come rescue us. Come on. Come behind me, Daisy. Okay, there we go. Hey, guys. It's Molly and Daisy, and our parents have gone weird and strict. And we definitely need some help over here. Um, so try to find us if you can, okay? Uh, um, because, uh, Molly, just give them the, uh, a dress. We're not supposed to give our dress out on the internet. Oh, yeah, just find us if you can, because our parents have gone weird and stupid. Okay, I'm sending the story to everybody at school. Someone will come rescue us. Molly, I hear Mom and Dad. Quick, put away your phone. Get into bed. <coughs> pretend you're sleeping. Okay, Molly, I'm, I'm going to pretend. Close your eyes if you're pretending. What's this? Two sleeping girls? I guess I don't have to give them another punishment. Yeah. But punishing them is fun. Ha 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 Told you they were weird and strict. Yeah, definitely. <laughs>
Yeah, 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 yeah. We can watch Coco Manny. There's nothing on but this news channel. What are they talking about? Well, a woman went missing for years, but our big news today, Stephanie, is that it's Wear Your Favorite Color Day. And guess what? If you wear your favorite color, you get a free ice cream. Wow. Say what? Oh my God, this is amazing. It's a fashionista's dream. Wear my favorite color, get an ice cream. How do they know if you're being honest about what your favorite color is, though? I mean, what if your favorite color is blue, like me, but you wear pink? They're just trusting you, man. <gasps> oh, wow, that's pretty nice of them. Well, I'm going to wear my favorite color. Oh, wait, I already am. No, Molly, you have to wear your favorite color all the way from top to bottom. <laughs> and I have to paint my skin blue? <laughs> okay, that's a little weird. I'll show you what, how to do it, Molly, because I'm a fashionista and I know this kind of stuff. Boom, perfect. Pink is obviously my favorite color. I even have a pink lollipop. Holy guacamole, Daisy. <gasps> your hair looks so different. Well, it's wear your favorite color day, so I decided to take down my pigtails and dye my hair pink. Whoa. <laughs> You're definitely going to get the free ice cream. All right, well, I guess it's my turn. And what's your favorite color, baby Kiwa? Rainbow. Oh, uh, baby Kiwa, you don't understand the assignment. It's supposed to be your favorite color. Ah, no, Dan, I told you. Rainbow. <laughs> I had it here with you. No, you're just supposed to pick one color. Just let her do what she wants. She's a baby. I'm sure they'll give her a free ice cream anyway. <laughs> I got it. <laughs> okay, well, um, let's get dressed. We can get our ice cream. No, we're getting dressed in our favorite colors because we love being our favorite color. No, I'm just doing it so I can get free ice cream. Why are you so tall? Take off those heels. I don't think so. I think these heels look adorable on me. Yeah, but they make you look a giant. Uh, correction. They make me fabulous. <coughs> Is everybody ready to go? Molly, what are you wearing? My imposter costume from last Halloween. It's the bluest thing I own. I'm blue. Molly, I am not being seen out in public with you wearing that. What? I think I look great. Aww. Oh, baby Kira, look at how cute she looks in that little rainbow dino sweatshirt. She looks adorable. That is a cute hoodie. But Molly, we are not going like that. Too bad I'm going like that. We are going for ice cream. Let's go. <laughs> Molly, you can't even walk in that costume. You just sort of waddle. Well, <laughs> too bad. Actually, I'll be waddling after I eat all that ice cream anyway, so I don't really care. Ay, ay, ay. I can't believe this girl is my sister. Watch this. This is so cool about Roblox. I'm totally going to teleport. <gasps> do, 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 do. <laughs> awesome. Uh, Daisy, why did you bring your own spoon? <laughs> they have spoons at Coastal Combs. What? What are you talking about? On the side of your bag, there's a spoon there. What? Honey, that's not a spoon. It's the handle to my bag. Um, okay. Anybody who's watching this video right now, slam the like button if you think Daisy's purse looks like it has a spoon on it. Come on, that looks like a spoon. It's not a spoon. Uh, this is a very fashionable bag. It looks like a spoon. I did not wear a spoon on my purse. Ay, ay, ay. Hey, Molly, look, there's a fitness center over there. We could work out after we get our ice cream. The only thing I'm worried about is fitting this whole ice cream cone in my mouth. <laughs> oh, yeah, very funny. Welcome to Coastal Cones. <sighs> what can I get for you? Yuck, we're very good, very good cone. And we get free ice cream cone. Ugh. Look, I haven't heard that all day. I'm wearing my favorite color. Give me an ice cream cone. What are you supposed to What are you supposed to be, a blockhead? Um, no. It's my costume from last Halloween. And it's from that game Among Us, and my favorite color is blue. Could I have a strawberry ice cream with two scoops, please, for free? Whatever. Here you go. Yeah. Being wearing your favorite color, day, she sure is grumpy. Hey, what's your favorite color? I don't have a favorite color. Say what? You don't have a favorite color? Who on earth 
cook doesn't have a favorite color. Apparently she doesn't, the ice cream worker. You might not want to eat that lollipop while you're also eating that ice cream. You're gonna rot your teeth. <gasps> um, yeah, okay, I have a chocolate ice cream cone, please. Excuse me, I did order strawberry, I ordered chocolate. Too bad, that's what you get. Um, yeah, okay. I want a rainbow ice cream. You get this, watermelon. She obviously is not very happy about it being your favorite color, Jim. I hate it. I've had to work twice as hard at this ice cream shop today because the owner said I had to give out free ice cream. Mwah. I think that made you really happy that you got to be so nice to people. Well, it doesn't. Come on, sisters. Let's go over to the beach and relax while we have ah! ice cream. Hey, you don't have to say thank you to me or anything. It's not like I've been working all day. What'd she say? Man, she was grumpy. Snapchat, Snapchat. Set me free. Take these colors away from me. Daisy, what is going on with your hair? And your clothes. You look like Corella DeVille. What? What are you talking about? Ah! Whoa, what are you guys wearing? Baby Kill, why are you dressed out in black? And Molly, what is what is up with you? What? What are you talking about? I'm wearing my costume. It's a totally different one that's just black and white. Like if I'm alien or some creepiness right there. O-M-G! We've been cursed! What? what are you talking about? It's in the ice cream, I bet! Stop eating it! Wait, but why? Why would we be cursed? I get yeah, the ice cream person who gave us the ice cream mad. And she made it turn black and white. And she made it turn black and white. Wait, what? Why would she do that? Um, because she's really angry about having to serve this much ice cream today. Did you not notice? Guys, I think the town is looking a little black and white too. O-M-G! Let's go talk to her. Maybe she'll change your mind. Or maybe she'll tell us what the antidote is for the ice cream cone. Ha 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 Ah, this is perfect! No more serving ice cream to all you brats! What? That's not very nice! You are more like the ice queen than the ice queen, Silver! That's right, I am the ice queen! Ha 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 I make everyone's heart turn to ice and everything black and white! <gasps> well, um, I was wondering, uh, could you kind of turn us back because I'm not pink. It's my favorite color. I don't think so. I just asked Snapchat to take all the colors away and everybody's losing their color one at a time until the entire town has been washed of color. <laughs> so you did this with Snapchat? Jeepers, I thought it was something you put in the ice cream. Nope. Snapchat granted my wish. Holy guacamole. Well then, if that's true, I'm gonna put out my Snapchat. Hey everybody, it's Daisy, and don't even bother. I'm the Ice Queen, and I'm in charge of Snapchat. Oh really, are you? Then what's this rainbow color? <laughs> oh Daisy, you're starting to sound like the evil one. Wait a minute. That put a rainbow face on me, too! How could this be? Well, I just happen to be amazing at Snapchat. And obviously your spell with Snapchat isn't working any longer. It is, because everything is black and white. Listen, if you hate your job at the ice cream shop, maybe you should try something else. I mean, evil ice cream's working for you pretty good. Wait, are you saying that I should try getting a different job? Yeah. You don't like the one you got, obviously, if you're turning the whole town black and white. Sheepers, creepers. Career change for you is necessary, I think. I do your job. I love ice cream, and I bet you get free cones, don't you? I like ice cream. If you work at ice cream shop, I will be there when you eat the ice cream with you, Molly. Ah! I don't have to serve ice cream to brats anymore? Huh. Why didn't I think of this before? <laughs> I'm off to be an evil
evil villain. <laughs> now hear me, world. I am the villain Ice Queen. Is she seriously standing on top of the picnic table? <laughs> uh, Molly, just let her have a moment. Obviously, she's totally crazy. <laughs> I will make the whole world black and white. <laughs> Whoa, losing my balance. Whoa. She's not really good at being a villain either. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what her job should be. Whoa, Molly Jack, a big ice cream cone bar with the freaking. I'm thinking that if we start serving everybody ice cream again, the world will go back to color. Ooh, that would be wonderful. Well, let's start with us. This ice cream looks delicious. I want some blueberry flavor. Mmm. A pile on some watermelon. What else makes me happy? Chocolate, strawberry, and mint chocolate chip. Woo, this ice cream looks so good. Daisy, it worked. Yay! We're back to our normal selves. And our town is back to color too. Um, the evil villain is still laying out there. And she's still black and white. It's because she's not happy. I think if we start giving everybody ice cream, everything will be back to normal. Agreed, Molly. Hey guys, welcome to my Snapchat. Today I'm working at Coastal Cones. And if you're still black and white, don't worry. I can change you back to color and you get a free cone while you're doing it. Head on down, guys. You think that will work, Daisy? Oh, well, here's our first customer. Hey, guys. Luke, <gasps> is that you? Yeah, I got the black and white curse and... Uh... I need to have some ice cream to see if I can get rid of it. What's your favorite? Mint chocolate chip. You got it. Mint and chocolate. Eat this and you should be back to color in no time. Wow, this ice cream is delicious. What happened to us anyway? Well, basically there was an evil ice cream that used a Snapchat curse to turn the entire town black and white, including us. Um, wear your favorite color day. I know, I was so excited about wear your favorite color day. Can't believe she did that. Yeah, she was really unhappy with her job. Whoa, it worked! Can you guess what my favorite color is? Um, green. You guessed it, Molly. You know me so well. Uh, yeah, we've been friends since preschool. Of course I do. Molly, what are you doing? Uh, last year's Halloween costume because my favorite color is blue, duh. Oh, <laughs> I should have known you would have done that. So there you have it, guys. Make sure you're using your Snapchat for good and not evil. Don't try to take people's colors away or their happiness away. Don't bully or be mean on Snapchat. Just be yourself and then other people will be themselves too. And come on down to Costa Cones if you want a free ice cream cone. All right, guys, have a wonderful day. And don't forget to subscribe. Bye!